what is this? Oh, you know what it is. Sierra Beach! <laughs> that was beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. It was really beautiful. <laughs> oh, welcome everybody welcome. to King's Quest V. This is a really special game for you, Dan. It really is. Let's, let's watch the introduction and then we'll learn more. Oh god, dude, I love Denver. stuff like this. Like, medieval stuff when I was a kid, and, and wizards dude, and such. I still love medieval stuff. Me too, me too. I love middle uh, evil. Oh, and here is a, an evil wizard, speaking of which. Um, so yeah, that's our castle. We're, uh, we're King Graham, the king of Daventry, and inside that castle is our family. Uh, Can I just say that the wizard looks like he is wearing a slanket? <laughs> right off the bat. It's like me when I animate. I'm just like, yeah. I gotta slink it. Yeah, thank you. Is that different than a Snuggie? Uh, they are technically the same thing, but different brands. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. Well, here we are just wandering nicely through the woods, like just having a pleasant stroll, completely unaware that our family was just sucked into a wizard vortex. Can I just say that I have never played this game, but it happens to be the favorite game of my wife, my beautiful wife Holly. She oh. loves this game to death. Yeah. And the one thing I've always, that's always ba baffled me about it is, he's supposed to be a king, right? Right. Why does he look like Robin Hood? Oh, because he's a king of the people. He's like, not a douchey, like, king who's like, oh, I decree, fuck you. So no crown. No, like, he does wear a crown when he's in his, like, throne chambers, but like, when he's out and about, he dresses like a peasant, to, so like, he can like blend in with the peeps. Seems like they're kind of like, they're not really stereotyping to their roles. Like, I mean, the wizard's wearing a slanket. He's dressed as like Peter Pan. Yeah, I know. Okay. <laughs> da, 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 da. Huh? My castle, <laughs> what has happened? I know, right? No longer a homeowner. Hopefully an owl will come and tell me what went down and he'll be wearing a tiny oh, vest. I can tell you what happened. Thank God. This is our boy Cedric. I know about Cedric, he's great. Holly loves Cedric, of course. Oh, I know what happened to your castle. I saw it all, yes I did. <laughs> <laughs> well then, what happened? Oh, he's adorable. Oh, it was the powerful and evil wizard Mordak who did it. Oh, I just happened to be visiting with an old friend when I saw him materialize out of thin air. Thank goodness he didn't notice me. Don't stop now, go on. <laughs> Keep talking, bitch. God. He conjured up a terrible whirlwind that swirled faster and faster around the castle. With another incantation, Mordak then caused the wind to draw the castle up into the sky and out of sight. Ooh, it was something to see, all right. Oh my God. God. He's adorable. I just want to so hold him. He's cute. Jesus. Why? He's like a beanie Why baby. this wizard, Mordak, <laughs> want my castle? What could he have against me and my family? God, I'm gesturing like an Italian man over here. Oh, I only know that it was Mordak who took your castle and your family. Booyah! <laughs> it just looked like he was making that hand motion. Yeah, like the booyah kasha. I to be a wizard, which is why I recognized Mordak. Ooh, unlike Mordak, though, my employer is a very good wizard. His name is Crispin Arthur. But we all call him Crispin for short. Oh, Crispin? The only Crispin. Is, you see. <laughs> what? All right. How does an owl fall off a tree? He's a very clumsy owl. If he yeah, flicked like, his wings like that, he would have flown. I know. But no, he's oh, fine. there we go. He's fine. He's fine. But he probably scuffed up that gorgeous sweater vest of his. Mm -hmm. Embarrassing. <clears throat> what a kerfuffle. Anyway, uh, yeah. Where was I? Oh, yes. <laughs> The only problem is that Crispin is getting on in years and tends to be a bit forgetful. He has Alzheimer's. My master's straight up dying. <laughs> Thanks for bringing it up. Crispin is a very qualified wizard. One of the best. He just gets a little forgetful now and again. That's okay. All. So, for the sake of time, we're going to skip the rest of this because he basically has said all the information we need to know. Oh, okay. Um, How did we get here? We are now at Crispin's house. So, we're gonna walk on inside and say hello to him real quick. Oops. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Oh, look. Don't be it's wasting Santa Claus. your time coming it's in not. here. Young man, I've oh. done all I can for you. Now Whoops. You. <laughs> Embarrassing. Text from my mom. Sorry. Well, anyway, I'm not going to be here. 
for a little while. There's an emergency I have to attend to yeah. in a neighboring land. I'll try to keep an eye out for you, but this is something you and Cedric are going to have to do yourselves. I wish you the best, King Graham. Thanks, man. He's checking his list. I appreciate He's checking all it twice. you've done, Crispin. <laughs> I'll be on my way now. All right. He looks like a really bad Santa Claus. I know. He's like Druid Santa like if, Claus. No, but like if you mix death and Santa Claus. Right. It'd, it'd be a downer. Mm. Let's see. He gave us something. He gave us a magic wand, I believe. The old wand doesn't seem to have any vitality left in it. Okay. So he gave us a useless wand. Thanks, you old dick. Wait. So the one needs to be charged with magic powers. Correct. Okay. Yeah. Where do we do that? So that magic wand, the only thing that magic wand is lacking is magic. Let's take a look around. This is a beautiful scene. Nope. Guess we can't look around. But there's Cedric. Oh, hey, Cedric. Cedric waits for Graham. Okay. King Graham, heavy of heart, searches far and wide for his beloved family who've been stolen by the evil wizard Mordak. Oh, too bad, so sad. Can you lick things? I, we cannot lick things. What? I know. This is not Leisure Street Larry. I'm sorry. What kind of Sierra game doesn't let you lick things? Uh, pretty much all of them, except for Leisure Suit Larry. Oh, and Space Quest. Space Quest, sorry. Oh, they're the only two I've played. Yeah, that's true. The only thing I knew about this game about was hey, what oh, this guy. A poisonous Yes! That was the only thing I knew about this a game. Poison a poison a snake. I used to always, we have a friend called Graham, so I used to, oh, I always say that to him, even though he's never played this game. Right. I'm just like, Graham, watch out! <laughs> a large, venomous snake blocks Graham's passage to the east. Okay. So, basically, uh, we are just walking through this forest, and uh, there's much to be done. We don't know what we can do to find Mordak. We don't know where we need to go to save our family. Did you try the yellow pages? We just, that, the what? Do you have them here? Oh, hold on, there's a crying guy. Oh no. Oh no! And a bird having a bird bath. You know what? Before we do anything, yeah. it's time to save. <gasps> ooh, ooh, I know, ooh, ooh. I know, Ross, I know. Okay, so you probably want to just say something like, here we are at the beginning. Don't cry, guy. <laughs> okay, Ross, you're so happy to do these. Let's talk to this guy, See what, see what's up. Uh, excuse me, young man. Sorry to bother you, but I couldn't help but notice you sitting there on that log. Like a pussy. I was wondering if there was anything wrong. Bitch. Why, yes. As a matter of fact, there is. My cowlick. I've been and he's a ventriloquist. for my fiance. <laughs> She's a beautiful princess with long golden tresses, fetching blue eyes, Whoa. and smooth creamy oh, there you skin. Go. Have you seen her anywhere about? No, sorry, I haven't seen anyone like that. Do they just hire family That's and friends what I to do the voices? It. Yeah, no oh yeah. Mm. Seen her. I bet that a witch who lives in the dark forest had something to do with her disappearance. I'll keep an eye out for her. If I see her, I'll let her know you're looking for her. I would appreciate that. Well, I guess I'd better get back to looking for her. Yes, yeah. I guess I'd better go back to looking for her. Yeah, by looking for her, do you mean crying <laughs> on a rock? What a weenie puss. <laughs> you candy ass. All right, so, ah, oh, it's a little bluebird. What a wonderful bluebird. <laughs> it could almost make Graham happy again if it wasn't for his family. What? Oh, yeah. Jesus, what a downer. What a downer. What a gorgeous bluebird. It would almost make me happy if I could feel happiness. Oh my god, he's, he's really depressed. Oh, dude, his whole fucking family's gone. I didn't even realize he had one. All right, so picture this, if you will. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, there's going to be a lot of exposition in these early... Mm -hmm. uh, in these early episodes, because the way King's Quests generally work were, um... Look at this nice little town. You, um... You walk to uh, different places and find, like, all these little quests that you have to help people with. Yeah, uh huh And then, like, you help them throughout the game. Through your oh, adventures. right. You're going into town. I'll just wait for you here. I had a nasty run-in with a big dog once, and I... Oh my god, save it, Cedric. What a yes, weenie. Sorry. sorry. So, um... Was, why, what? Listen to this fucking town, it's wow, crunking! Look how fucking fast those guys are running, Woo! but not really. They, like, look like they're having seizures while running. How goes it with you, good fella? It's remarkable. Not well, I'm afraid. This old wagon's always giving me trouble. Can I 
help you in any way? Thank you kindly, but I think I can handle it. Do they know he's the king? Alright then. Good no. luck. He Thanks. With this wagon, I'm gonna need it. He, he just walks among the common people. And people don't notice that he's the king? I'm gonna turn the music down a little bit. Okay. Cause that's, I'm down with that. Yeah, it's... Turning it down, that is. Pretty loud. Okay, play. Play. Uh, let's, let's go all up on in here. What's that say? The sign. Uh, bleh. <laughs> but what is it? I don't know. We'll find is out. Is it an inn? Oh, no, it's a tailor shop. Oh, look at that guy's nips. Easy, bro. Help you, sir? God, everyone has, like, the flip around here with, with their hair. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I'm interested in buying something here. Ah, let me show you some things. Looks like that person has a mouthful of water. Yeah. They're just going bum, 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 I can make you beautiful shirts. There isn't a more beautiful piece of fabric to be found anywhere. With this, I could make you the finest trousers you've ever had. Trousers? Yeah. Well, what do you think? Well, right now I'm just looking. Thanks, Ben. <laughs> Back off. Sure, sure. Whatever you say, I'm just here to help. I'm going for the hard was sell. It, was it um the in the UK they call pants pants or underpants? I don't know. And then in it, like if you say like oh I'm wearing pants, right here, it means you're wearing me you full undies. That. Dude, I'm not even sure if this is a man or a woman that we're talking yeah, to. Yeah, I was so. a little bit, I didn't want to say anything. Perfectly. It just looks wonderful on you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thanks. Let me tell you, it will certainly keep you toasty warm during the coming winter. Toasty warm. Is anyone going to do anything Let about the naked man? No, he's fine. I wish my head wasn't right there. Okay, mm. I, I can't afford this, I don't think. It's a fine cloak. It could be very useful to a traveler like yourself. Did you leave your wealth in your castle? Yeah, I... Oops. Yeah. Well, shit, man, I was only going out for a stroll. Could you use your ATM card? Yeah, there are those... Could you call your bank? <laughs> uh, so, okay. Oh. What's that kid running in front? Oh, he's playing that little tiddlywink game. Hang on. With the wheel and the stick. Do you see a little glinty thing? Yeah, what is this? No, what is that? Graham notices a shiny silver coin lying for... <gasps> on the We're the rich! Line. Give it to me. Oh my god. Bending down, Graham quickly retrieves the silver coin from the street. Yeah. Nice. All right, let's see. So how much is that? Is that like that is coin? Is that like worth like a shitload of money? One silver coin. Okay. <laughs> is that like 50 cents? <laughs> Something, I don't know. Uh. Inside the barrel, Graham sees an old rotting fish. Great. Ross, let's take a That's fish. That's a common tender in this land. Yeah. Graham leans way down into the barrel and removes, phew, the smelly old fish. God, Nailed he's it. describing it like a dick in a romance novel. Oh, man. So we have, uh, like, a nickel and a fish. And a wand with no magic. Yeah, this sounds like a Sierra game. Yeah, I'd say we're off to a great start. And if you can MacGyver those things together, you get... Fish coin. Club. One. Yeah, on a stick. <laughs> you get fish fingers! <laughs> yeah! Hooray! All right, see you next time. I'm glad we're doing this little adventure together. Me too. See you tomorrow. Bye. I love you. Welcome back to Steam Train, everybody. Oh my god, have you noticed the same people are going past multiple times? Yes. It's some Truman Show-ass shit. I feel what? like behind one of these walls, there's gonna be like a crafty table full of food. <laughs> oh, we're in the toy maker shop. Oh, look! Come on in. Whoa! Look around. Let me know if it's the guy who made Game of Thrones. Oh, it's George R. R. Martin. The shipment of carving wood hasn't come in yet. Hello. What should we do? If it's not in by tomorrow, oh look, tomorrow, it's fucking uh, Indian Jon Snow. Here. Okay, Papa. <laughs> okay, Papa. Yeah, Goodbye, Papa. Oh, okay. Can I keep this doll? I really like her. <laughs> no, you pay for dolls. Absol <laughs> <laughs> you pay like everyone else. Absolutely not. Wow. <laughs> what do you think this is, charity? I think this thing might. Are we frozen? No. Oh no, there we go. It's loading, man. Okay. Oh, it's it's shit. Shit. Yeah, right. Fucking patient, Besides, bro. You've got Sorry. plenty of dolls. You can play mid air, but just be careful. I need to sell that shit, you know. Yeah, Jesus. Don't gross it up with your tiny monster hands. <laughs> uh, uh. Oh, come on, God, lady. Dude, All you know. Right, Grandpa, I'll take care of her. Okay. Those audio clips are, uh, you know, like. They're huge. Papa. Why did you yeah, put those new dog clothes Mama made? Whoa! Oh, and now- Whoa. Oh, okay. Someone turned up the party music. 
Is cause, what is he doing to the what? What is he doing with his hand? Uh, he's uh, I don't know. <laughs> You're gonna have to speak up. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we like to keep shit crunk in here. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, it. Jesus. Just give me this sled, man. <laughs> this sled? Yeah. I can't hear a goddamn word, but I think you said you can have it. No, he said any child would be happy to have it. Oh. <laughs> Did you say, would you like to buy a sled, you know? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> would you like to buy a sled, you know? I said it's very nice when it snows. What? <laughs> Let's get out of here. Jesus. God. Oh my god, the music went- I think you need to go to the options to turn the music- What?! Wow. It just decided to turn back yeah. up again? Whew. Alright. Wow. Alright. Oh, I- This is a shop too, I think. Oh. Is it the back of that shop, or is it a different shop? Nope, different shop. No, it's a- A oh. dog or a cat you or something. Look around if you want, but we don't have any shoes to sell you right now. <laughs> oh. We sold our last finished pair yesterday. Our business ain't doing so good anymore. <laughs> the brakes. We're getting too old she to just keep sounds, trying. She just sounds like she's like looking at it and going down and reading the script. <laughs> yeah. We're getting too there ain't nothing you old. Can do <laughs> sort of buying us out. Please ha like feel I free to look around at our no products. Around, What's my motivation okay, here? Thanks. You're old. Yeah. All right. All right then. Oh, oh God. look, it's Geppetto. The shoemaker wearily hammers tiny nails in a shoe sole. He doesn't even seem to notice Graham. Oh, okay, so this is just a sad situation. Let's get out of here. I don't think they talk much. No. Okay, so so far we have um, uh, a toy store where with a sled that we can't purchase, a mm -hmm. tailor shop with a nice blue cloak that we mm -hmm. can't purchase, and a fucking shoe store with no shoes. Don't forget the fish, the magic wand, and, well, I mean the non-magic wand, and the coin. Well, yeah, well that's what we've got. I'm and a piss poor owl that's too afraid to come into town. Yeah. And this sweet ass cow. What's oh, up? Yes. Secure within a small pen, a spotted oh, cow quietly chews her no. cud. Okay. Can I punch it? Come on, Graham. Don't waste your time with that cow. <laughs> Jesus, Cedric. Don't bust me around. Fine. Yeah. Who do you think you are? Yeah, I know you're very busy. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I know you're very busy fucking sitting on a goddamn branch doing fucking nothing. All right. Well, there's we'll, gonna be uh, plenty of owl puns. Yeah, through this, thank uh, you. God, playthrough. he's fast. Oh God, how'd he get there? He's he's good. He's real good. Um, all right, let's increase our walking speed just a touch. What part of Europe is this? This is this is Daventry. This is not Europe. Where is that in England? It is not a real place. Oh. <laughs> oh my God, it's okay. Yeti. That's the end. Wookie. The, there's some dangerous. Oh, it's shit. a hay pile. Yes. Um. Oh, it's a bear! Oh my! Oh, the bear, Graham? Quickly, Wild needs honey. Save the, the game, quick! The bear seems to be very interested in the honey inside the old tree. Save the game! You're gonna get killed by you, the bear! You're right. We should. All right. Go for it. Maybe something like a uh, bear attacking a uh, bee's nest. Winnie the sh is a bear. What the fu- Alright, fine, thank you. Thank you, Ross. Okay. Let's lower the speed a little bit. Let's see what we got. Ah, uh, bears like- Give him a coin! Okay. Hold on. Let's see if this works. Yeah, baby! Is he wearing lipstick? See you later! I'm Queen Beatrice. Oh, I'm hey, baby! That's a hot little bee right there! Oh, damn, there's a bee in her bonnet. Mm. from the claws of that horrible bear. Mm. We were just busy huffing helium. Yeah, she's... <laughs> she's got a little southern accent. All right. So she just said... What? Uh, that was that was Queen Beatrice. She's, How big is she? She's a bee. Like, she's an actual bee. Yeah, she's an actual bee. She just said the bees won't harm us so we can get uh, some honeycomb. Graham reaches a hand into the beehive and retrieves a very sticky chunk of honeycomb, Ugh. wrapping it in a protective piece. Oops, I guess I, I yeah I wrapped it in a protective piece of something. Oh, yep, okay we got honeycomb, and uh, also mm -hmm. since this was 1990 and mm -hmm. Sierra, 
mm -hmm. stuff that you needed mm -hmm. will stand out horribly from the background. Oh, yeah. So that stick. Like, m more so pixelated than everything else around Ryan it. bends down and picks up the large stick from the ground. All right. Is that a stick to find water? Oh, I found it. <laughs> Ross, what the hell is wrong with you? All right, let's keep walking. A dousing rod. That's the one I'm thinking oh. of. Oh. Is that a cat? It's a... It's a dog. A well dog done. Terrorizes the I poor think. Ants Just a hunch. At their large okay. Is this going to be an ant king? Yeah. Queen? Yeah, probably. Are all bugs really sexy in this world? At the huge ant hill, while the poor ants <laughs> scurry about frantically. That's up to you to decide, Ross. All right, let's see it. Uh... Oh, the stick. Hit it with the stick. No, don't hit it. We'll play fetch or something. Oh, that's right. Dogs love sticks. Yeah. I would never hit a dog. I love dogs. Shoot. Sure. Remember the corgi puppy we saw? Wait, hold on. Plot. Oh my god. It's the Ant King! So fucking sexy. <laughs> so fucking sexy. Ross, please get away from me. <laughs> so fucking sexy. Ross! <laughs> We're seeking a way to cross the Great Mountains to the ocean on the other side. Don't. Get away from the mic. So fucking sexy. Ross! But thank you so much. In return for rescuing our home from that pretty distant cur, I wish to offer you our help, if for chance you may ever need it. Thank you very much. Thank King you, Andy. I'd rather get <laughs> things, please, but... Your kind of you know what I really want? Ross, again. I want ants in my pants. Ross, come <laughs> on. Like, what is with you, man? Alright, so, so the ants are now our buddies. Oop, I can't look at that. Um, Alright, we should save it, because some progress was made. Winnie the Sh is a bear? <laughs> what are you doing, man? Der Sans. Oops. <laughs> the space doesn't work. Whoa, that's some more of the backs. D There's ants in my pants. All right, good job, Ross. Oh, Sierra games with you are just a joy. I um, know. <laughs> See what's, oh, look at Cedric! Yeah, he, dude, he's literally been in every scene that we've been in. Oh, really? Yeah, he flies and follows us. Stalker. Is, what is that guy doing? I, I believe he's whittling. It looks like he's jerking it. Wait. Gypsies. What's up, Moo Cow? Let's see here. Hello, fella. Oh, no! It will cost you one gold coin to see Madamushka. Is that his cow? I... He looks weirdly thinner in the smaller, uh, like when he's close up. Doesn't he? The sullen man doesn't appear to be the conversational sort. Did they say southern man? Uh, sullen. Oh, I sullen. I yes. was like, oh. Okay, so I don't have any gold coins, so... Whatever, he's gonna die of dysentery anyway. He's not gonna die of dysentery, this is an Oregon Trail. You get that from wagons. Is that right? Mm-hmm. Okay. I don't know, I made it up. I mean, it's possible. So, I just want to say before we continue- Whoa! Whoa! whoa wait, what, I got what? ants in my pants! Ants in your pants! Okay! Oh! Oh! oh. Ooh! Is that the new Dan Graham? The Bugaloo! <laughs> bugaloo! <laughs> the Bugaloo! I, uh... Just before we continue mm -hmm. uh, with mm -hmm. this playthrough, mm -hmm. I just want to say, try mm -hmm. to imagine it's 1990, mm -hmm. and third grade Dan mm -hmm. is playing this game and losing his mind with, with how happy he is. It's... It's a little guy with a marionette. Or is it a tiny man with a Ross, big man? Ross, get away from the microphone, please. You're abusing your powers. You're not my mom. Ross! <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Oh, I'm terribly sorry to bother you. I was just noticing your son's marionette. It's very interesting. Where did you get it? I think I'll take it. It's grandson, not son. And I made it for him. Why do you care? Is it a I no just wanted to comment dwarf. on its artist. It's very well done. I don't suppose it could be bought. If it could, the price would be very steep. The price. I reckon you could The price would be it. very steep. Now, leave me and my grandson be. Oh, what a dick! Wow, what a d hole. Whatever. What a d hole. Just kick me in the b hole. Sitting on a stool in front of his house. I... Maybe I'll just be an old man and talk to your. Graham attempts to speak to the young gnome, but the boy seems to be very Oh, it's shy. a gnome! They're gnomes! Oh, they are gnomes. Okay. I thought it was a gnome. Alright, so these gnomes are kind of dicks, and they don't want anything to do with me. Fine. I'll keep walking. Just 
Whoa, oh, look at that sexy tree. That's beautiful. She's crying, dude. Look at the roots on that one. Ross. Dude. Oh, this part. I Is it crying? Yeah. It's a weeping willow. Yep, that's exactly right. Oh. A graceful weeping willow tree. Oh, I got it right. I know my trees. Created from her tears. In her branch like oh. arms, she clutches a beautiful harp as a child would a cherished toy. This. This part used to make me so sad when I was a kid. Why is she so sad? I'll tell you in a second. Will you? Yep. That's uh, fine. Miss Willow? Yes? You can talk? Why, of course you I can. You started the conversation, Graham. Well, I've never seen a talking tree before. What's wrong? Everything's wrong, can't you tell? I'm not really a tree. I'm really a princess. You see, my fiancé and I were walking through this wood when a nasty old witch came along and was instantly charmed by my handsome prince. When he naturally refused her advances, she jealously banished him to a faraway land and turned me into a tree. Then she stole my heart. Stole your heart? Yes. She turned my heart to gold and took it away with her. A bitch. The only way I can become human again is to have my heart brought back. Now, all I have to cheer me up is my heart. It's quite magical, you know. It plays the sweetest music you've ever heard. Now please, leave me alone in my sorrow. Oh god, it's so sad! She's like that. She's a really weird face. It's, she's beautiful. She's a beautiful, sad princess. Well, you know, I believe, if I remember correctly, I think she is the girlfriend of the crying guy who is looking for his fiance. Oh, yeah. Oh, spoiler. Yeah. Well, it's not a spoiler. I mean, like. You're, you're trying to help don't two people. Don't step in her tears. Oh, you God, it is her tears. You don't know where they've been. It's all salty. Let me Except, drink it. Oh, can you? I don't know. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Throws back up. That salt water. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's her tears. Ugh, Ugh, salty let me taste tears. your tears. So delicious. I love your delicious sorrow. Oh, it's so sad. God, All right. I wouldn't well, want to be by that tree during that time of the month. Next time... Oh, Ross. Barry, you know what to do. Ross, next... Make me louder. I wouldn't well, want to be by that well, tree. Well, by well, that well, tree. Well, Ross, next time on Steam Train, we'll start helping all these people whose sad fucking stories we've heard. Hooray. You think she's been a tree long enough to, like, learn another song? <laughs> yeah. she, could, she, could she go on tour with this one song? I, that, Uproot her? Oh. Bring her to Woodstock? Oh my god, Ross. <laughs> that a, oh. I, I almost want to start the episode over. <laughs> <laughs> so, alright. So we are about to venture into the desert because we mm. need to find uh, some treasures so we can pay this fortune teller. Ooh, there's nothing but a hot dry desert for the West. Most people and avoid it because there are bandits out there. I know. Ooh, if you insist on going, I'll wait for you here. Oh, God, Cedric. BMX bandits. Yeah. Oh, my vagina's bothering <laughs> me. Oh, I can't join you. Oh, oh Graham. Oh. I have an injury. It's a, it's a high vaginal sprain. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the way this desert works, I'm going to pick up the speed a little bit. Um... The way this desert works is when you go five screens, uh, it'll give you a warning that you need uh, water. I think I'll go oh, really? Speed. Yeah, because you start to get thirsty. Um, when you go eight screens without water, you die. It's because you're wasting all that energy walking so fast. Yeah, I know. Look, an entire screen. So the um, the trick here is there's oasises all over. O oasis? 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 Here's the, he must drink, and soon. Here's the. That's eat, the warning screen. Eat the fish. The, I, we gave the fish to the bear, Ross. Eat the, eat the honey. And the fish is not liquid. Honey is also. Drink the tears. Oh, wait, oh. Wait. We went too far. Nope. Okay. Time. Time to save. Time to save. Cause shit can get dangerous around here. <laughs> Go for it. Just maybe something like bandits will show up soon or water sucks gatorade rules <laughs> that's just as good thank you russ okay a small pool of water has formed in the space between the two rocks all right 
Let's drink from that. You're so gonna get killed by bandits. Also, what's that building behind you? Well, that is a forbidden temple filled with treasures and stuff. The forbidden temple? Hence ah, the forbidden! Graham can now feel strength and renewal flowing through him. From okay. across the desert sands, Graham can hear the sound of approaching hoofbeat. That's not good. That's All right. bad? Well, that, it's good, it needs to happen, but we need to hide. Uh-oh. Okay, cool. We hit enough. Open sesame! Really? Yep. That's like having your password being admin. <laughs> the password is password. <laughs> okay. All right, so now we know the password. Let's get all up in there. Whoa, whoa. Open sesame! Yes! Yeah, we get it. Just do it. What happened? Oh, nothing. Um... Go Open sesame! The temple door won't open. What? Perhaps there's something missing. Uh, oh, that bandit had a staff. Do we have to go steal it? We do, we do. Hold on. I got a, I got a little map action. You got a map action? Yeah. Because, the, like, like we've said before with Sierra ah, games. Um, giving water. Nectar of the gods. Uh, Great. Yeah, we know. He's, he drank water. Um, Sierra games, a lot of times, this would be the only game that you'd have. So, right. you, you had time to, like explore shit forever and ever right and like really like map out an entire thing but that shit takes forever and we don't want to bore the audience no so i just got a little map of the desert telling me where the oasis sees oh good there's one. one yeah it's beautiful i love how it's a, a waterfall water coming from nothing it's tantalizing water so sparkling <laughs> yeah. in the desert sun graham's hot thirsty body is irresistibly drawn to literally it. they're describing everything in this game like it's a dick from a romance novel like <laughs> his long thirsty slimy <laughs> what are you talking about like everything the like fish the water, the water. Mm. The go gods. look up a fucking oh, romance novel and listen to describe a d nectar of the gods <laughs> just said all right so we're gonna go let's we gotta go south three screens and west one and then we should be at the bandits' camp, where we can snag their shit. Um, but this could be dangerous. Ooh, mm -hmm. Here I go. No. Hold on. Let me come on over here. Uh, oh, uh, oh, oh, hi. Hey. Okay. Got to be real careful. Ah. Oh, look, they got a that, dancing girl. That's not good. And that guy's drunk. That guy's drunk as fuck. Those horses are dressed with Christmas lights. Oh, it's a party up in here. Oh, damn. Let's save the game. What are they plugged into? Uh, okay. Um... Just type, like, bandits or something like that. Christmas horses. Yeah, that's good, Ross. I can easily fucking figure out exactly where we've been based on this uh, outstanding uh, list of saved games you've done. Oh, there's a Christmas camel, too. That... <laughs> okay. Um... Now you just need to judo chop these people. A large clay jar full of water stands by the campfire. Okay. Drink that yes, I actually should. Okay, we have to or... be super careful here. You could put out their fire with the water, and oh, then they'd be really cold. Giving water, <laughs> nectar of the gods. Graham can now. They'd never be able to build another fire. <laughs> They're only fucking desert-dwelling bandits. Okay, I can't go in here because clearly, like, um, they'll that girl. See me, so maybe. Yeah, she looks in, in like the wait. When did this game come out? 1990. In 1990, could, did that girl give you a little bee? A little what? Bee, like a boner. Oh yeah, like a tiny bee. Mm, tiny bee. What are you feeling? On a beautiful carpet lies a sleeping bandit. I didn't know. I didn't know what bees were. Yeah. I, di I didn't understand. I didn't like, understand it the, either. The first time, the first time I got a, uh, first time. Let me steal this shit and then be out of here. Taking care to be very quiet. Shh. Graham reaches out and takes the staff into his possession. Hey, cool! God damn it, Ross! Ah! Uh, you're lucky this isn't voice activated like the the connect. The connect. <laughs> the connect. Man, yeah. No, I remember. I remember 
Who oh shit! Oh, fuck! Fine. That's not good. Oh, oh he fucking shanked you! Damn, he wasn't fucking... a very smart move for Graham to make. What do you mean wasn't a very smart move? I was leaving. All right. He heard our connect. All right. Let's try that again. Let's put out their watcher. Let's pick up the speed. Okay. So all I was gonna say was, uh, man, boners? he stabbed us right. We're talking the about little face. boners. Yeah. In the in like in the sense of when we had little boners. Right. Right. Not now. Not now. Not now. Because that would be wrong. Yeah. Those are gigantic boners. Mm. Oh, oh, my magnums. My 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 package of magnums. I left a, I left that lying there. But anyway, me, please tell me about the little boners. Well, I just remember like being in like first grade or whatever, mm -hmm. and coming into like the lunchroom, and uh, let me steal this shit. Yoink. Taking care to be very yeah, we know. Maybe if I stick to the edge. Okay, cool. Take one more gulp of water. Uh, ah, life-giving water. I know. So yeah, like yeah. Uh, I, I remember talking to another kid uh, at the lunch table, yeah. and he was like. It's weird, man. Whenever I see sex on TV, my dick like grows. Do you have that? And I, I was like, inside, I was like, yes, man, of course, that shit happens all the time. But like outwardly, I was embarrassed. So I was like, no, fucking weirdo. You should probably see a doctor. <laughs> Something's terribly wrong. I remember I was talking to one of my friends, like my childhood friends, and like we were probably like fucking tiny at the time. And like, we're just like, like in front of our parents, just like both our moms, just like, do you ever get like bored at night and just like grab your wiener and just like play with it? Oh my just God. like just fucking play with it in, just, fr in front of your moms. Yeah, in front of our moms, we're just like I just like it's just when I'm bored. I just grab my wiener, just give it a wriggle. You know, it just feels oh. good and it's fun. <laughs> What'd your and mom say? My mom, my mom and and his mom were just like like oh, turning red. They were like so know. embarrassed. Were they laughing? They were laughing. Okay. They were like, awesome. boys, don't talk about that. And we're just like, what? It's, it's it's fun. Yeah, it's awesome. I'm just get bored and you I play with my wiener sometimes. You should try it. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, dead guy. Uh oh. A picked clean and sun bleached skeleton lies in the sand of the hot, dry desert. What happened? Who can say? But it makes Graham uneasy, nevertheless. Uh, he died. And he lost his sock. That's what happened. Oh, yeah. What is that? Oh, shoe, maybe. An old shoe lies oh, oh, forgotten good call. near the poor skeleton. All right, can you take it? Yeah, I'll take his shoe. I'm not above taking a dead man's shoe. Uneasily, Graham reaches down and removes the old shoe from the desert sand. It's the last thing you much to help the poor man now, and vice versa. Oh, well, all right. You know, it's about talking about, like, shit naively and, like, not really understanding crap when you're a kid. Mm -hmm. I remember this one time, this ad came on for menstrual pains. Okay. And, like, I was like, there's like, do you have pains in your lower stomach? And, like, they were, like, showing diagrams of people with, like, the red, like, pain yeah, yeah. Like, going up and down inflammation. And I was like, Mom, I think I have this! And yeah, it was like, my mom just burst out laughing because it was an ad for, like, period pains. Yeah, my sister course. started laughing at me. I was like, how do you know about this? <laughs> <laughs> Those are always the best. <sighs> Those fucking, like, I don't know anything about the world moments when you're a kid. Absolutely. Oh, my ovaries. Or when you, like, learn something from your parents when you're younger. And you learn years later that it wasn't true. Oh, absolutely. I don't know if I ever told the story on Steam Train, uh -huh. um, but my, like you know when people are like, oh, you shouldn't eat and then go swimming, right? Right. I might have told this in Castle Crash or something, but okay. like my dad said, you shouldn't. Well, people always say you shouldn't eat because uh, you shouldn't and you shouldn't go swimming, right? Right. And that's because you get cramps. Right. But when I was a kid, I asked my dad this: Who's a doctor? Like right. he's a general practitioner. Right. And I said, why can't I eat? And he's like, oh, oh because it it messes with your buoyancy. Okay. And I was just like, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Like, I won't be able to float. Like, right. that's dangerous. So up to, like, 21, I, like, people were like, oh, it's like how you, I said something like, oh, it's like how you can't eat because, before going swimming, because of buoyancy. Right. No, I, let me save this one. No, 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 no. You're I, not allowed. Oh, my God. Ro Ow. Ross, jeez. Sorry. No, kiss it back? no, no, don't. No. Everything's wrong. Everything's okay. wrong. Okay. God damn it. You're, like, right up on me, dude. I'm sorry, Dan. I'm sorry, Dan. <laughs> that's okay, Ross. You're for... For girl. <laughs> You're for... Give me. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> okay. Uh... Alright, now if I recall correctly, I have to do this shit quickly, because it's only open for a second. Oh, really? Yeah, and you have to get your shit and then get out of there. Or else it closes in and you're stuck there forever. Do you get squishy squished? I don't know. Oh, you have you get you get stuck in there forever? Open. Yes. Because it only opens from the outside. Oh, 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 oh. oh. oh oops. No. Oh, that's why. Right. 
Whoa! All Where right, go? here we go. Grab it! Uh, uh, okay, gotta grab the coin. And the pot. Bending down, Graham hurriedly picks up the gold coin from the temple floor. Right? Oh, yeah. And this thing. Quickly, Graham grabs the old you can grab all bottle. that shit, I bet, but you just can't get out. In time. Exactly. Hurry. If you're... The exit door is about to close. Ah! Damn! Okay. That was close. All right, we made it. Yep, there's a little lesson on greed for you, kids. Mm -hmm. You'll fucking die. Can I grab the staff at all? Or is it... The staff is broken and is of no use. All right. Oh, Got no. it. Got it. Oh, no. But now yeah. we have... Uh... Let me see what we got, actually. So, wow. A shiny gold coin. Wow. Uh, this is an old tarnished brass bottle. Oh, Probably brass. sell that for a few. I can't re remember what happens with the brass bottle. Let's save it just in case. And then before we end this episode, mm -hmm. we'll, uh, mm -hmm. we'll see what happens. Ugh. So like brass bottle or something like that. Brass hole. Okay. <laughs> well done, Ross. Um, okay. It's a genie! Oh, nice. Ah, oh, freedom at last. Now you spend the next 500 years in a bottle. Oops. Oh, wait. Ah! Oh. You fucking dick! Graham should know better than to keep things bottled up inside. Do uh, I get three wishes now? Yeah, right? One of my wishes is not to be turned into fucking smoke and stuck in a bottle. All right. Uh, it's like a bad trip. Yep, restore. Okay, so we're going to take it from here next time on Steam Train. Choo-choo! Bye. I don't think we ever said that at the end of an episode. I'm, I wish you had kept that streak going. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, you look so sad just now. I was just kidding. <laughs> Welcome back, back to, to the show that doesn't quit. Oh, Ross, Jesus. <laughs> you gotta get me all salty right off the bat. Just like tears. Yeah. Mm. So we got a gold coin, and we're going back to uh, the gypsy. So she can uh, take our little fortune action. Was it a gypsy cow? Uh, that is not a cow. The cows don't have horns. That was a bull. You didn't say that. Cows have horns, don't they? Uh, male, what all the cows? Son and choking what about an ox? It, yeah, sure, it could be an ox, but all cows are female. Ross. I know that. Right. The the male form Don't of cow a is a bull. <laughs> okay, just just letting you know. Okay, cool. We're here. We're back. Oh, Cedric, good Where to see you. Are? I was just starting to get concerned. Don't worry about me, Cedric. I'm used to this kind of thing. I was only stabbed in the face in the desert. <laughs> Everything's cool. All right, let's slow it down because there's going to be some information here. It will cost you one gold coin to see Madame Mushka. One gold coin. One gold coin. To what see what a coincidence. Mushka. Here is my one gold coin. Take it. Take it. You may see Madame Mushka. You know what he looks now. like? Crocodile Dundee, but like. With a like douchey from like cartoons. some European country. Oh, hang on. For information or clues. Yes, you're Please absolutely right. Game. Okay. Please be sure to check your inventory if you decide to skip. Nope, we're gonna watch it. Let's do some plot. So, you are here to see Marimushka, no? Yeah, that's you. Well, come closer. Deep down, I She's will tell you your fortune. Already, I can tell that you are on. A quest of great urgency. We will see what we can find out for you. It's like Looking a quest of great um, urgency. Hold on for 15 minutes. The yeah. crystal ball. Let me take my time while I talk. Look, Mananin. Look what I have for you. Oh, that's your son. Take a good look at what you did to my brother, Alexander. Because of you, he's doomed to spend the rest of his days as a cat, and there's he's a lot bigger than the castle, though. But you can okay. do something about it. Since you're the one that did this to him, you're the cat. only one who can like turn him horse. back again. That's back to the wizard menace. He's a scumbag. Alexander! My cat is not a scumbag. I don't know no, how, Mordek. I'm on. not a wizard. I just happened to stumble across some magic spells and accidentally turned your brother into a cat. I didn't mean it. Please believe me, Mordek. I don't know how to turn him back into a wizard. You're holding out on me, little man. What You're taking dick. advantage of my good nature, but not for long. If I don't get a change of tune from you soon, I'll feed your family to the cat.
starting with your dear mother. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. That's the woman we banged. Remember what I said. I'll only give you a little more time to decide before your family becomes cat poop. That is all. Did he say cat poop? But cat I see what? That no, I think it's a cat food. Oh, that would make more sense. It would become cat poop. Yeah, eventually. I will give you something to help you. Here, where is it? It is a magic amulet. It will protect you against all but the most powerful magic. You know, for a guy... Good luck, well. Ingram. Be careful. That's a girl. No, no, no. That's oh. I was gonna say, for a guy who just saw his Thank son you, nearly being fed to a cat... He's pretty chill. Yeah, he was like, feet centered on the floor, arms resting comfortably in the, in the chair. Alright, so... We have to, uh... We have to save our family. Yay. So this goes back to King's Quest 3, mm -hmm. when your son... The cool thing about the... Oh, oh God, it's so sad. Cry me a ri... Oh. oh. <laughs> Give me time, I'll turn it into a river. Uh, the, so, like... The cool thing about the King's Quest series was each game you were playing a different member of the family. Oh! Yeah, so in King's Quest 4, you were the daughter, Rosella. Really? Yep. yep. I didn't know that. It was very cool. I've and only it, heard of this one. And in the third one, you were the son... Okay. And so what Mordak, the evil wizard, is referring to, mm -hmm. let's save this before we go into the evil forest. Was the previous games. Yes. Where you turned his Oh. Uh, where his you brother. turned his brother into a cat. I love shit like that, man. Like yeah. that's so cool when like everything ties together. No, you're not allowed to save! Yeah. No, 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 ah, no, ah, no, 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 no. Oh well that you have to base it off of what I God damn it, Ross. <laughs> Ross is really cute. <laughs> He's so stupid. Alright. Here we go, into the dark forest. Whoops. All right. I missed, missed by a bit. I bet Cedric won't follow me in here, because it's the least bit dangerous. Enter at your own risk for it, Slash. Oh, no. Oh, I'm not going in there. Oh, oh God, you candy ass. Little Come wiener. On, Cedric. There might be something important in here. Go if you want to. I'll wait here. <laughs> but Jesus. God, what a butt. I'll just enjoy my bitch flakes. Oh, look, a little frog. Okay. All right, so this place is definitely evil. Straight up Eves, yo. Now that frog, evil intent, criminal yeah. intent. If criminal intent. Okay, let's see. Where? So, we are on a little- Oh shit! Ah! Oh! Matrix, oh! dodge it. Nope. Did you turn into a frog? I, I that did. old witch caught Graham totally off guard. That bitch. I thought I was supposed to- Ross is really cool. Ross is really cool. Oh, okay. I I seem to remember that, like, uh, the amulet the gypsy gave you should protect you. Yeah. But I don't think we ever put it on. So, let's see. Ugh. The magic amulet begins to glow softly as Graham slips mm. it over his head. He then carefully tucks the amulet into the front of his tunic, hiding it from sight. All right, there we go. Let All me right. guess, it's going to bounce back to her. Or a frog. Oh, we know, we know, Cedric, you're a fucking puss. Um, yes. I don't know if it turns her into a frog exactly, but uh it will it will at least protect us. Where is she? She shows up randomly. Oh, that's right, she's a teleporter. Yeah, she's the worst. Oh, it's random! Yeah. She you, you so just all these people are people. I mean yeah, frogs. Exactly. All these frogs are are wanderers that she's oh, turned. That's her house. Yeah. Let's go in. I don't know if that's her house. Probably. It looks like a house. house. I think it's just a little, like, what? A, a little cupboard. A cupboard? Thing. Hold Were on. you there when Aaron was talking about the person in Little Tokyo that used to make crepes? Graham tugs like, firmly on the door in the tree, but finds it securely locked. <laughs> it's a door in a tree. Okay, sorry. No, oh. I was not. So, like, apparently in Little Tokyo here in LA, I, th I guess this place closed down, but Aaron told me there's, like, this little hole in the wall, or used to be. Mm hmm where there's literally just like a little thing like that, uh -huh. and you just see a guy's hands, mm -hmm. and a Japanese man makes crepes. But he does, he never talks, <laughs> and he just makes the crepes. And if you walk up and you're like, um, I think I'd like, uh, he like tells you to fuck off. Really? Like instantly, and he does the whole thing, because in Japan, they like, they won't apparently handle your money. If you're a foreigner, sometimes they'll put out a tray and expect you to put it on the, right. on the tray. Oh, but, boom, boom! Great relief. It appears that the witch's magic has been stopped by the amulet he's wearing. That's what I'm talking about. Just as Madame Mushka said it would. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
But yeah, apparently this guy just makes crepes and you never see his face, but his thing got shut down. And I tried to find a video of the guy making crepes because it sounded really strange. Mm -hmm. Like you'd never see the guy's face, just a dude making crepes. Hands in little <laughs> Tokyo. That is bizarre, ah, dude. Like a puppet Tokyo show. May look Wait. like an ancient old woman. This witch is really very powerful. Oh my god, looks like, much the, too strong looks like a ginger version of the main the murderer man, from Scream. She staunchly <laughs> defends her bridge. Alright, let's talk to her. Let's chill. Yeah, let's try diplomacy. Hello. What are you doing in my forest, young man? <laughs> Don't you know you're trespassing? <laughs> oh. Oh, I didn't know this was a private forest. Mm. Do you own it? Damn, of girl. Of course I own it. <laughs> it's mine. And what did you do to my magic? Uh, I don't think you need to know. <laughs> now tell me something. King How Sass. How did you leave this confusing forest? I'll never tell. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid you're stuck, I'll get you and your little dog, too. Now you're my prisoner. We'll see about that. Damn. Mm -hmm. Yes. Won't we? <laughs> Listen to King Sassy Pants. Mm. Uh, all right. What King, have, got, King, King Graham's got stones, man. What have we got that... Could you put her in a bottle? A oh, genie bottle? That's a good idea. Let's try that. Give her some honey. I'm not giving her honey. Oh, that's good. I heard the ding. What this? Freedom at last! Now you spend the next 500 ah, years in a yeah. bottle. Oh, like yeah! Genie Witch in a versus bottle. Genie! Gonna rub you the right way! Ross, is I... Is that how the song goes? Yeah, it is how the song goes. Good. In, in, not in tune? I just wish you hadn't sung it. For a long time. <laughs> no. Now, You're beautiful. how do we get out of this dreadful forest? Alright, cool! Let's... <laughs> Now that we've sucked her into a bottle for eternity. Where'd that evil genie go? I'm Let's... more worried about him. Oh, he just floated away. Oh, okay. He just wanted to be free. Okay. Nice house. Yeah. Well, there's a shiny thing in her lamp. Yeah, I saw a glinty thing. Let's go right for it. What's this? Why, it's a little key. Oh, a little key. Okay, there's a treasure chest here. A small, intricate spinning wheel is put away in the trunk. I will take that. Reaching a hand into the trunk, Graham retrieves the small spinning wheel. Sweet. Um, okay, let's see what else. The old witch's house has been crudely fashioned from an old tree trunk and salvaged stone. Being cold and creepy, Graham finds he would just as soon hurry up and leave. Okay, let's see what this is. The old witch's house has been nope. crudely well? Graham spies a small drawer built into the trunk of a tree. Ah, there you go, there you go. There it is. You open up yeah. some big floppy fucking yeah. alligator dildo. <laughs> <laughs> like two prongs. Oh, God. Just one spins and it's oh, and clockwise. I know, I know what alligator dildos do. Really? I don't, I don't. What is this thing? A small leather pouch is tucked away in the Ooh. drawer. I'll take that pouch, brah. Graham reaches the drawer and removes the leather pouch. Oh, I bet I know what we need to do, Ross. What do you have to do, Dan? What did we just encounter that required a small key? Do, do you honestly not remember? No, I don't remember. The, the door in the tree from like 30 seconds ago. I forgot. Yeah, you looked at me so blankly just now. You're like, <laughs> I, I wish everyone could have seen that. I was I, like, I'm sorry, what? I. Oh, I thought it was a window. A, a window? I, uh, you know what? You were busy telling about stories crepes. about Japanese crepes. That's what it was. Yeah, okay. if anyone has seen a video of this thing, I'd love to see it. It's really bizarre. It sounds really weird. Little Tokyo. Maybe Aaron a has a, knows where I could see it. I don't know. It super, sounded super strange. It's like, that sounds unusual. And a guy that tells you to fuck off, you don't know what you want. Yeah. How did you even know he was out of business? I wonder oh, if. Oh, because Aaron used to eat there, I guess. And uh, he said it's not there anymore. I wonder if the, yeah, the hand just comes out and gives a thumbs yeah, down. Yeah, thumbs down. <laughs> he was the only dude that worked there, I guess. Let's, let's try this. See if this Poke works. Put a hole in it. 
Graham finds that the little key fits perfectly in this yeah. lock. Graham is charmed to find a little golden heart inside the door of the twisted old tree. The golden heart. Oh, that's like a butthole. It's Ross. Don't ruin this moment. That's that's what the weeping willow needs. Maybe we'll give her some talent. Oh. Reaching dick. into the little door of the tree, Graham extracts the little golden heart. She plays a lovely harp. Yeah, one. All right. <laughs> one lovely harp. All right, we still got to find our way out of this forest, which I think is weird and hard. How would you like it if I played Frere Jaca? How is it Frere Jaca? Frere Jaca. That's all I know. It's my only song. Next time on Steam Train. Da ba da ba da ba 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 da ba da ba Frere Jac. Oh. God. Welcome back to Steam Train, you lovely passengers. Hey. Hi there. All right, so we are in the forest. Ross, could you get your foot away oh, sorry, from my- I was... Like, it's like inches from my face. Ah, God! Ross! Ross just put his feet on my face, and this needs to stop. All right, so we're, we're in this forest, and as you noticed, Ross, mm -hmm. this is not the way we came in. No, uh, it's not. What happened? It, because that's what she was saying, the witch. She was saying, like, we're we're trapped in her forest forever because the 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 way is shut, basically. Oh. Uh, yeah, so... How are we gonna change that? I don't know. I seem to remember something helps you, so we gotta look for something that's, like, out of the ordinary in these... It's definitely not fucking frogs, because oh, those I was gonna say. are everywhere. Oh, the eyes. Okay. Hills have eyes. Yeah, th this is... Those are definitely something. Peering curiously at him through the heavy foliage of the dark forest, Graham notices several pairs of bright, blinking eyes. I only count six. Let's talk to him. I mean, six eyes, not six pairs. Good call. Thanks. I <laughs> count. Um, Alright, we have to... We have to... We have to lure them out, or whatever. Um, first, let's see what's in this bag forgot to check. Upon opening the leather pouch, Graham discovers three sparkling emeralds. Ooh. Ooh. We're rich. Maybe that's what we have to use. Will money work? Let's get, let's give them money. Let's make payment. No? Okay. Oh. Oh. There you go. Oh, Yay, they're, they're gremlins. Uh, oh. Elves? Gremlins? Yeah. The fuck, man? Oh, you gotta throw throw each one for one of them. There's three, and there's three eyes. Oh, okay. So maybe you... Well, it's that same douchey one. Are you doing it right? Are you sure? Uh... Maybe you gotta go forward more. Like, what happens if you try to walk past? Will they attack? Oh, maybe if you give them all three, they'll help you. I don't... No, I don't think so. I Because I remember there was something to this. We have to trap them. Oh! Right, you gotta trap all of them. Can you Can you refresh? Go back? No, I, I... Well, because you need three to catch all three. No, 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 no. I only I only need I only need to catch one. And put down the trap. Because one's going to show... We, we don't below, have a trap. Below. What's that? This? Yeah, what's that? It's a little spinning wheel. Oh, well, they might get caught in it. I don't know. Okay. This situation seems to require very careful thought. Graham needs to spend more time on this. Apparently. All right. I guess not. But, but it gave us that answer, so like... What about the sack? Oh, like catch him in the sack? This situation seems nope. to know. But it, it, if I know Sierra games, like when it gives you an answer like that, you're on the right track. The heart? The no. heart's for the tree. This situation. Nope. The boot? The honey! The honey's sticky! Oh, Ross, if you're right. Fire. If and you're I'm a smart man! I'm gonna high five you if you're right. Yeah! Accept that high Except five, Ross. You earned it. Onto the ground, creating a sticky little puddle at his feet. Still now, sounds like a Roman novel. What's left of the honeycomb is a piece of beeswax, which Graham puts back in his pocket. Oh, sweet! Ooh. Kept the wax. All right. Ooh. Um. Let's try this now. Right in the honey. You stop, yeah, bitch! Yeah, you fucker! Oh! oh, I got you! Now I'm gonna eat your fucking head! Let's move go! Why should I do that? What will you do for me? You. Mm. I'll show you the way out of the forest. <laughs> there we go. go. I'll suck your- I mean, I'll, <laughs> I'll suck your way out of the forest! <laughs> I give you my word. 
And help. I don't even need a meal. Hard. Ugh. Well, it's against my better judgment, but okay. You better not fuck me on this. Whoa! You're in our way. The fuck is that? Mm, sorry. <laughs> mm, sorry. Oh, I love it. That was the most horrifying looking thing ever. Oh, I loved it. Rocky has moved aside to allow Graham another passage Rocky! through the forest. All right. All right, cool. We're out of here. Amazing. Great Fantastic. job. Wow, Ross, it's you fucking... Fun. You got that one. I did. Follow me. Follow me. Gotta love his little voice. Oh, fine. Jesus. I'll take my Reminds sweet me of the, time. The, the baby voice I do that scares the shit out of Aaron. Which is what? Oh, that's super. <laughs> oh, wait. Hold on. Ross, I, I hate to interrupt you, but we've got to watch this. Please be sure to check your inventory. Okay, we will. Ah, Jesus. It's creepier when you're right next to my ear. Wait, plot! Ross, stop! <laughs> so, so uncool. So who's your urethra are you going through? Uh, gods. Cool. <laughs> oh, maybe, maybe there is no plot. Maybe it's just... Oh, no, there is. Oh, really? Yeah, we're, we gotta talk to these dudes. Undercut snobs. Yeah. Hey! Over here! I've got something for you! Uh-oh. Why do they sound like they're guzzling water upwards? <laughs> Excellent question. <laughs> I never take anything without giving in return. For your generosity in giving me those exquisite emeralds, I give you my finest pair of shoes. Oh, that's nice. May they help you in your quest. I bet we give them to the cobbler. Not the cobbler. Oh yeah, the cobbler. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> Don't you know who does fucking shoes? Yeah, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Thank you very much for all your help. I'm sure I bet you're right. I bet you're right. I bet you're right. For these fine shoes. I bet we have to find something to give everyone in each of those shops. Mm -hmm. So, bye! And now we have something to cobble. I think everything's gonna be good. Yeah. Okay, cool. Mm -mm. <laughs> just cause I'm a, a baby. Just cause I'm a 55 year old man doesn't mean I can't wear tight, tight pants and slowly work my way up a shaft. We're men, manly men. We're men in tight steers here. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> That's my boy. It's a great, great movie. It is. Oh, I'm glad to see you're okay. I was beginning to worry. Thanks for all you your help, right Dick. right not to want to venture in that dark forest, Cedric. I thought I'd never get out of there alive. You sound like a man who's, like, super freaked out about the mm -hmm. whole situation. <laughs> there were gnomes and there was a witch. <laughs> oh. He's so chill about everything. Oh, what a sad song she plays. Let's try to cheer her up, Graham. I hope when she turns back into a woman, she gets an electric guitar instead and starts fucking rocking. Oh, oh God, it's so sad. Okay, yeah, I just got a lot sadder. Shut up, Ross! <laughs> Here I stand in my pool of tears. Oh God, man, this fucking hurts my soul. Let's make her happy. Let's get all up in her tears. No, I bring her some cheer, and then we'll go have a glass of beer. Yeah, good job. Thanks. Oh, I hope this makes her happy. My heart, you. Oh my God, she's becoming a woman. Yeah. I don't need this old thing anymore. Oh, she's super hot. Whoa. Okay. Look at me, I'm a princess again. What? Yay! You just gotta throw away that Alicia. your career as a musician. There's her. <laughs> and get married. Yeah, a lot of people do that. I hope you never. Where have you oh, been? I mean, you can get married, but just don't. don't okay. I want beautiful music. I want. The world needs it. I'll tell you on the way. I desperately need cunnilingus. Yeah, you all get, right. You keep the heart? Yeah, I, she doesn't need that shit anymore. Whatever. Boom. I just want to have babies. Now, why would she toss aside this beautiful harp? Well, if she doesn't want it, I'll <gasps> take it's it. It's going to turn you into a fucking tree. No, it's not. That's not how it works. The witch turned her into a tree, not the oh. harp. Oh. All right, cool. 
We ha we helped our first person. Now this is a puddle of salt water. Here I stand in my pool of tears. Oh God! Now let's go have a nice cool beer. <laughs> We are spreading that Christmas cheer. I hope this comes out around Christmas. I like that you're singing into my ear. <laughs> I, uh, I, oh, I couldn't think of anything that didn't rhyme with queer, so I was like, I'll, I'll just, I'll just avoid it. Please avoid saying that word. Well done, Ross. Look at that tiny little blue bird. Oh, don't even try to cover it up. Let's. I think we need to get back to... Oh... I wonder if we have anything that these guys would be into now. Money. Boots? Money. Do you like money, gnome? Do you like money because we ain't got honey? I got everything I need. Do you? Oh, well, what about... Do you have... a harp? I don't take charity, young man. All right, fuckhead. What about currency? What about this thing? Oh! Oh! Nice! Where did you get this? I thought I had lost it. Oh, is it yours? I found it in the old witch's house in the dark forest. So that's where it got to. The old hag took it, eh? You know, this ain't an ordinary spinning wheel. It's not? What's so special about Tell it? Tell me all about it. It turns backwards. Right. This spinning wheel can spin straw into gold, that's why. Oh, oh, for fuck's sake, He's man. fucking Rumpelstiltskin. I don't even know which could that? figure that out. Rumpelstiltskin, the, uh, the guy who could spin straw into gold? You never heard that tale? I know of it from a movie called Don't Shrek. The price of the spinning wheel is worth at least twice that of the puppet. <laughs> I'm familiar with the pornographic film Rumple Foreskin. Yeah. I guess so. Boy, give that marionette to the man here. I'll make you a new one. Come on, boy. Oh, Let's it's... gather up some wood for a new puppet. But Papa, I want to keep my marionette! Wow, that's super fucked up. You know that thing you love more than anything that you play with all day? Give it to this man, because he gave me a thing I wanted. <laughs> I love that you gave me something I needed. Nice. So I'm going to take something my son wanted. Nice grandfathering. Yeah, I know. Wow. Parenting 101. A large haystack dominates the area in front of the barn. Yeah, if, just... if you put your eye, the eye icon in front of that, uh -huh. look, put your eye in front of it. It looks like a scary monster. Oh! <laughs> Hold on. Graham watches with surprise as a contingent of ants marches into the haystack and begins to swarm through it. Oh, our ant buddies are gonna help us. Mmm. Wait. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! I fucking love this. Woo! Thing. Ants, motherfucker! Ants! Ants! In your motherfucking pants! Ants! In your motherfucking pants! Ants! Touching all the shit in your pants! Ants! 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 Not uncles! Ants! Everybody loves ants! I'm glad to see that it was a way that we could be of help to you! Look here! We found a golden needle in the haystack! Oh, dude, they found a needle in the haystack! I don't like it when you're close to the mic, Ross. I'd like to put a needle in your eyes. Alright, get away, get away Why, from thank that. Thank you, King Anthony. I'm honored. Cool! Your troubles, King Grim. Oh, you know who would need a fucking golden needle? The Batman. No, the fucking tailor, Ross. The tailor with the blue cloak from the clothing store. Do not remember any of this? You are looking at me so blankly right now. Alright, you know what? Next time on Steam Train, I'm gonna give Ross a little refresher course on what the hell's going on. And let's save the game, because we, we did a lot of progress. Who am I? Just write, got golden needle, please. That is, what? Alright, thank you, Ross. And we'll see you next time! Welcome back to King's Quest. Better than your mom's breasts. Oh, it, it's, well, I don't even know how to respond to that. <laughs> it's good, it's certainly good. I love this game, dude. We're on, like, a nice, like, little quest. It's it's actually not a little quest. You go you go a lot of it's places. It's a journey. Yeah, you go a lot of places in this game. Still can't go in the inn. Um, You're out of the inn. Yeah. You're not on the inn. We crowd. need to go to the. Um, is this the bakery? 
Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. We need to go here. Let's see. Okay. Ooh, I wait for you here. Oh, God. Good. Fine. Jesus. Good. Like I was gonna bring an owl into a fucking Wait, bakery. is that that dude from the infomercial who died? Billy Mays? Yeah! No, it does not. Oh. oh, she hasn't been doing too well lately. <laughs> but my brother and I help out whenever we can. Thanks for asking, Billy Amanda. Mays here, here, offering a delicious selection of custard pies. Custard pies? You like custard pies? We've got yeah. custard pies. <laughs> what is in our custard pies? Custard. Good job, Ross. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Let's go home, Austin. Oh, okay. Gotta. Oh. Do you think they sell anything other than custard pies? Here's the last of the pies. Oh. Oh. Welcome to our bakehouse, traveler. Of course, all of our wares are wonderful, but today we've got a special on custard pies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Got Did it. Did not see that coming. All right, let's 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 buy some pie. We have got. Hopefully one silver coin will be enough. Sir, I would like to purchase one of your custard pies. <laughs> These pies cost one silver coin each. But for an additional <laughs> dollar, yeah. I'll throw in an additional custard pie. <laughs> Buy oh, two, I'm get sure. one for the price of two. <laughs> awesome. Okay, cool. Do you know the Led Zeppelin song, Custard Pie? No. Get it up I have not heard this. Custard pie. No, 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 no. Did it. Too late. Saved it. Woo! I saved one save game with information that is helpful to me later. The world is wrong. Everything's wrong. You sense it. You know it. <laughs> he doesn't know it's coming, but it's all ending soon. Wow. I don't know what you were saying there, but that is, is very disconcerting. Death becomes so, all. Whoa. I will kill him and cat. bury him in a shallow grave. Oh right. shit, Ross, this is- Oh fuck, 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 no! Snakes and cats! Ah, ah, ah. What was that? Did you need that? Oh, we have to restore. It all came back to me. First of all, get away from the mic, dude. You're like inches away. Is that important? Yes, super okay, important. I'm getting louder as I move back away from the mic and now I'm out again! Okay. Fuck. I forgot all about that. That rat was our buddy in the future. And we just the future? Yeah, we just let her Is get- Is he a time-traveling rat? We just let her get eaten. Good we thing I saved this with a logical save point. Ah, oh, I forgot. Th th see, that's that's a fucked you up thing about- You know why you fucked up? What's that? Because you let me save. Yeah, you're probably right. And death- Death just- Death comes. Oops. When you don't let this me save. Icon brings up oh, I know, I, I know. <laughs> okay, so I gotta slow the speed way down. Um, I can't believe you saved. I can't believe you saved. The ultimate betrayal. Um, okay, we'll bring it up until that thing happens. Um. Suddenly, okay. frantic squeakings alert Graham to a mangy cat chasing a- Alright, we know. Quigley, punt the cat! Okay, bring the speed way down. Are you gonna go bullet time? Ah! Well, that cat's a bit too fast. Hey, super fast. <laughs> throw something at it. Um. Oh, the marionette would scare it off. Not the- not- you don't throw a mar- the boot! The boot! I'm not throwing a marionette at a cat. I need that thing for go. Too late. The yep. This is what happens is when you don't let me save. Too late. This All is right. what happens <laughs> when you don't let me save. Ross, the fact that I saved is exactly why we're in good shape right now. Custard pie is why you're gonna die. I don't know what that means, Ross. Ow! Fuck! Stop! Ross just threw the paper at me. Ross just curled up into a, what I can only uh, call a bitch ball on the on the edge of the couch. Just sat in this ball, not a bitch Ross, ball. Ross, you're gonna fucking have so many opportunities to save. But I wanted all of them. <laughs> I wanted all of them. Uh, all right. Let me let me ready my boot. Get your boot ready. You dick. You dick. Suddenly, frantic squeakings alert Graham to a mangy cat chasing a terrified rat. Oh! Got him! Oh, thank you, thank you, good sir! Oh. You saved my life! My children and I will never forget your kindness! Maybe someday I'll be able to return the favor! Adorable. Oh, I hear my children call me! With a blowjob. Ross, enough. <laughs> Look at a ferret, not a rat. Bye, honey. Aw, oh, she's a sweetheart. 
So this is one of the many fucked up things about Sierra games. Mm -hmm. If you don't save that rat, and you can see how quickly that happens, and you just be like, well, that cat ate a rat. Whatever. No big deal. I was wearing a hat. Yeah, you can't complete the game. What? Yeah. Yeah. Because you need that rat to save your life later. Are you fucking with me? No, I That's mean... bullshit. I know, it's fucking crazy. So do people, like, when this game first came out, got really far and like, why can't I beat the game? Of course, of course. Like, you just needed to save the rat. Yep, it happened nonstop. And there That's were nuts. And there was no internet, so you Can couldn't, I like... You, so you just had to go by word of mouth. Is that guy still there? Yeah, he has been trying on stuff for a long time. Not really, he hasn't put a goddamn thing on. Let's give the golden needle to this dude. My golden needle. Yay! Where did you find it? It was in a haystack by the country inn. By the inn? Mm -hmm. Oh yes, I remember visiting there not long ago. Mm -hmm. Oh bugger man, that innkeeper. Mm. He has no scruples at all. What were you doing with the innkeeper well, in a haystack? I was playing with his scruples. I wonder. <laughs> and he found my golden needle! <laughs> to give me that wonderful cloak in exchange for it? The cloak? Well, why not? It's yours, for the price of a golden needle. <laughs> why not? It's the only Thank thing we have in the store, sir. which is I'm why sure that guy's still naked back crowd. there. <laughs> I'm sure it will. Good luck. Au revoir. Thank you, miss. Possibly, dude. Okay, we got a cloak. But don't forget we got the cobble shoe. Yep. I'm gonna give something to everybody. Come on in. Oh, he'll love the marionette. That's exactly what I'm thinking. Interested in anything. So yeah, I'm interested in you finishing the fucking sixth Papa, book of Game of Thrones. Mama yeah. When are the I dragons coming? Ugh, enough. You read Game of Thrones, right? Uh, I mean, I, I still yes. of was. Yes, uh, I love it. What's, what's the? I, I, I've, I'm, I'm read it. What, what is the actual title? Game of Ice and. Song of Ice Song and Fire. Song of Ice and Fire, sorry. <laughs> Everybody runs this like, go do this. Oh god, the fucking music. Yeah, why do they turn up the music? This guy just cranks the music. It's like. Hold on. It's Wunderbar! Wunderbar! Well, I don't know if you'll believe me or not, but I got it from a little gnome. I must have Whatever, you crazy bitch! <laughs> Papa, can I play with it? No. Nine! <laughs> Nine for Borden! Why, <laughs> of course! But I must tell you, I think I'm getting the better deal. I can always make another sled, but finding another marionette of this quality... Oh, okay, so we're gonna trade the marionette for the sled. Cool. You know what? He's got deals that slay you. Ross, I got- I'm gonna, like, pick you up by the feet and Thank throw you out the window. Much. Like a marionette? I think I'll find this sled very useful. Cool. Well, you enjoy it but Papa, that is my sled! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> but it is- I will not have a thing to ride on when it snows! Alright, well... <laughs> okay. I will just have dirt! <laughs> You will slay on the dirt? It's you again, is it? We still don't have any shoes for sale. But do you have any shoes to for fix? buying? Boom! What have we here? Now I'll Mom, talk to you! Shoes, man. Finally a reason to talk to my wife! <laughs> <laughs> that, yeah, this feels like a sexless marriage. The finest mm -hmm. pair of shoes I've ever seen. The leather is soft and pliable. Yes, See? The Sounds like he's talking about dicks. It does. Is the bird. And mama, look at the solid gold buckle. Why Holy the shit! The then the shoes are yours. I don't think I can find a better use for them. You are a god, said young man. Are you still in front of the green screen? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, we'll key that out later. Yeah. Just knowing I helped you is enough We'll for put you in space later. Aww. Just know he helped us well, enough. It ain't much, but it's all I've got he to just do. gets off on helping people. Yeah. He's a good dude. That's good fetish. Perhaps you can find a use for it. They did give us something. Since I'll be retiring, I won't need it anymore. I couldn't hear. Thank you. Because you were chatting. Why, thank can I you. give you a thing a that's hammer important? Be very useful <laughs> on my journey. Oh, a hammer. He's giving us a hammer. Oh. Take care, young man. We'll never forget this. Whatever, shut It'd be up. It'd funny if he hit his... I'm sorry. If he just, just, he just bashed like his wife. If he just hit his wife and hit his dog in the ding plane. <laughs> it's like, what? Come on, mama, let's go home. Let's celebrate our good fortune. Aww. 
Well, the dog went with them. Yep. Looks like uh, we got shoes. We're gonna be rich. Looks like it's a sexless marriage. No more. Mm-hmm. All right, let's get out of this town. Nothing like a pair of shoes to get the blood running. We've <laughs> Looks like we've done everything we need to do. Okay, now we are ready for the inn. Now we can join the inn crowd. Very nicely done, Ross. Thank you! <laughs> Nailed it! Okay. Well, you got a hammer, so you can. Nail it, you know what I mean? Ross, do me a favor. Yeah! Save this game. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Nake. Nailed. It. Also, thanks, Dan. Aww, you're welcome, Ross. You're welcome. Sometimes too. I give you a hard time, but you truly are one of my best friends. Yay! Dork. Oh. Ooh, I'll wait for you out here. In I front of the green screen. Yeah, ma! Where it's safe. Oh. Hey, guys. Hey! You look like some ruffians. But gentlemen, please excuse me. I didn't mean to interrupt you. They're loading mean things to say. Diana's bull ain't got no more rooms. Hey boss, this guy looks like a real troublemaker. What do you want me to do with him? Rub him out. Oh, oh shit! Sons of bitches! Graham could not escape his bonds. It's a shitty inn. Well, but look. Oh, there's our little Jesus Christ. Whoa! It's quite a sound effect. Oh, what the fuck? Did she Kryptonian rat with fucking laser vision? What was she that? She was badass. So, that's it. If if we had not saved the rat, we would have just been stuck in there forever. And, like, you can't complete the game. If you didn't save the rat, ain't, we would have gone back. Ain't that some shit? Okay. So this looks like a good place to save. I mean, to uh, quit for this moment. But yeah, let's save it. Let's save it anyway. You want to save it next time on Steam Train? Nope. Thanks, Rat. <laughs> okay, next time on Steam Train, uh, we'll figure out uh, how to sneak out of this inn. Bye. Welcome back. <laughs> Sorry, did I interrupt you? Were you going to say something? No, I was going to say welcome back. Uh, good, 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 good. Yeah, yeah, we're back. like, so this is the rope that we just got out of, so let's take Grant that. It's actually a chain. up the sturdy rope from the stone floor. Or it's a rope. Well, it looked like a chain in the last episode of Steam Train. <laughs> Sorry, show it looking like a chain. It looked like a rope. It looked like a chain. Um, do I... Alright, it doesn't look like we can take anything in here. Maybe the torch? I feel that was like miscommunication between the animators and the artists and the, the script writers and the voice actors. It was a chain. It was straight up a chain. It's a lot of Leave in the comments. Chain or rope? Jesus, Ross. <laughs> a rusty padlock securing the door prevents Graham from leaving the cellar. Go through the rat hall. <laughs> Good idea. Use the marionette. There is we gave the marionette away, Ross. Well, you blew it. <laughs> um, Use the hammer. Oh, yeah. We'll just fucking just break out just and bash our way shit out. out of all of them. Using the cobbler's hammer, Graham pounds on the rusty padlock until it breaks apart. Boosh, boosh, boosh! Fuck yeah. Alright. Let's get out of here. Now, let's bust some goddamn heads. <laughs> I don't think there's too many of them, dude. Whatever. Graham they, looks around the inn's kitchen and finds it rather sparse and untidy. They, like, ganked you while you weren't even looking. They did gank me. In the corner of the room, Graham spies a large kitchen cupboard. Okay. Graham looks around the inn's kitchen and finds it rather sparse and... Okay. What, are you gonna make a fucking sandwich? Go kill them! There's something in here, I'm sure. Like all these things. <laughs> you find an AK-47. <laughs> Ding! No. Oh. oh, a little bit of meat! Inside the cupboard, Graham sees a large, juicy leg of lamb. Oh. Mm. I think I'll take that Wonder shit. how long that's been there. Yeah. Graham pulls out the savory leg of lamb. It's savory. Oh, is that all I needed? There is nothing else of interest inside the kitchen. Okay. I guess it's time to fucking leave. Mm-hmm. Because to the right is where those guys are, so I do not want to be oh. there. Oh! Finding the kitchen door locked, Graham unlocks it before going outside. Peace, bitches! Hey, Cedric. Thanks for thanks your for help. help. Oh, you've been gone a long time. Oh, I was worried about you. Not really. No, mm. not for really and truly. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, what's this? There's bees everywhere. I'm scared. Oh, there's ants everywhere. I'm so scared. 
Gypsy, oh, the gypsy wagon's gone. Oh, they left something on the ground. What's that? I don't know. A tambourine lies on the ground near the abandoned gypsy encampment. Oh, I remember. Not seeing the tambourine's owner, Graham bends down and rescues it from the ground. Rescues it. Rescues it. As okay. opposed to steals it. Yeah. Do you know what a tambourine might help us with, Ross? Uh, our rhythm and our music. <laughs> and our blues. Yeah, rhythm no. and blues. What, what did we encounter a long time ago that sounds a little bit like a tambourine? A bear. That is incorrect, Ross. A horse. Once again. A dog. Not. A fish. Nope. A wizard. Oh, man. This is the worst. A wizard. You are the worst. A snake. That's the one! Yay! Okay. Rattlesnake. Let's fucking do it. I didn't know it was a rattlesnake. It could have been any kind of snake. Let's deal with this bitch. Could it be a tiger snake, a, a trouser large, snake, a venomous Shh. snake blocks Graham's passage to the east. Okay. With the power of music, <laughs> we will stop this snake. We're gonna save it first. Thank you, Ross. The power of music! Love it. Thank you, Ross. This is the most unhelpful fucking list I've At ever least it seen. helps Barry name the fucking episodes. I guess so. Uh. Okay, let's try this tambourine. <laughs> yeah. That's not what tambourine sounds like, does it? Be gone, you slithery varmint. Scat! His music is too good! <laughs> I'm ashamed of leaving. Okay, cool. We did. I could never rattle that good. <laughs> Embarrassing. All right. Let's go visit. I believe this is the Snowy Mountains, I think. Oh, did you bring a coat? Ah. Uh. A few hours later. Oh, shit. You'd hope so, because that's quite a transition. Yeah. Between, uh, biomes. I... Graham begins to shiver at the sudden drop in temperature. Oh, I did bring a coat. The fucking cloak. Oh! Yes. Boosh. Graham dons his warm cloak for protection against the freezing mountain air. Okay. Oh my god, now you're wearing a slanket. Na yeah. Oh, you're, you're ready to take this wazard on. Look how regal I look. Yeah, you look like a badass. I know. Some Lord of the Rings my shit cool right here. I, dude, this environment is beautiful. It's gorgeous. Oh my god, I forgot to tell everyone. Um, by the time, oh, I think by the time this airs, I'm gonna be in Australia. Oh. You know that. I'll miss you. I will miss you too. But I'm actually going to New Zealand, and uh, me and Holly are gonna stay in the uh, the Hobbit. Well, not stay, but we're gonna stay near the Hobbit Shire for a day and uh, go check out the Hobbit set. I'm really excited uh, to go see the Shire. So, I'm so pumped, man. So jealous. Oh, it's gonna be so cool. So uh, uh, if you if you see me in New Zealand or in uh, any parts of Australia, and mainly Perth, Perth. I, it, it is not a double ganger, it is actually me. The icy cliff is much too steep for Graham to climb without help. Um. These are my parents. Is much too I miss them. Graham to climb Aww. You miss your help. parents? I, very much. Yeah. When was the last time you saw them? Three years ago. Well, oh actually, my well, I mean, God, in, I, I'm at Perth. I mean, I haven't seen Perth since for three years. About three years. I, I They came and visited, like, last summer. Uh-huh. Um, but I haven't seen my sister in three years. Wow, that's and crazy. And my sister just got engaged. Congratulations! Barry, put up balloons. <laughs> that was very good. Thank you. Here, we'll save this game. Um, Maybe uh, Lord of the Rings Mountains? Lord of the Herb. <laughs> Thank you, Ross. Okay. Um... So I need to get mm -hmm. up there. And this is a chasm that I, I will die from. So... Use the meat. The rope. That's what I meant. <laughs> Maybe to the branch? Oh, yeah. Let's try it. Use your, like, bat hook shot. Nice. Yeah, there we go. All right. <laughs> oh, it's terrible, Graham. Shut up, owl. <laughs> Wait. Oh, oh fuck. Did you, like, break your neck? What? Yeah. Oh, oh my god! Not god. just like, ow, the, the soft snow broke his fall. Nope. And it's like, his soft spine broke his life. Yeah, dude, look at him, he's just straight up fucking dead. And the, the owl's just like, ooh, be careful! Alright, so branch does not hold my weight. 
Okay. What about um, if you tie the rope to something? Can you do that? Like this? No, no, no. I meant like, like make something like a hook shot. Stomach beginning to rumble with hunger <gasps> from the exertion of the mountain climb. Oh shit! Do you have, do you have food? Do you yeah. Have, do you have? All food? right. What do you have to eat? I do. I have the have? the leg of lamb. Eat that shit, bro. You um, need the protein to survive. The protein's good. It'll get you beef. <laughs> Duh. Up. Graham finds the leg of lamb a bit tough. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, the coffee makes me burp. I know. I had a, I had a I, I'm, peppermint I'm like, ice mocha. I'm millimeters from your face. I can, I can smell no. it. Yeah. Mm. Thank you for that. Hold on. Let me climb this rope. Uh, thank you. It was extremely helpful advice last time. Okay. Can I get that rope? Is it just gonna bring me down? Hmm? Oh yeah. God damn it. <laughs> All right. Sorry, everyone. I've wasted eight seconds of everybody's wow. time. Man, they really, really fucking animated that rope. They could have just kept it as a straight line, but they were like, "Not nah, fuck it, we're going all out with that effects animation." Dude, I'm telling you, like, man, they really went all out. This game, like, I'm sure it seems like charmingly mm -hmm. like antiquated and everything now. Yeah. But this game is like 25 years old. It's amazing. I mean, like nothing looked like this. You, there's so many shortcuts they could have taken here, but they didn't take them. Like the cloak moves when he's walking. The uh, yeah. could just mean a static thing on top of him. We need we need to save a lot. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ross, the speed at which you lean in every time. Yeah, it is. Good. I would say good job. No, no problem. Okay, I I think I have to jump. Like, for the, what, what year was this? This is 1990. Wow, yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. It's fantastic. I mean, it's better than most, like, uh, NES games and Super Nintendo games. Yeah. Whoa. Okay. I mean, we had, like, Don Bluth doing... Like, oh, okay, okay. okay. Well, we had Don Bluth oh animators doing god, games, oh but, god. oh my god, that looked sounded painful. All right. Restore. All right, noted. That one And is... sound, good sound. Yes. <laughs> with, with for the technical limitations they had, quite impressive. Oh, yeah. But you can hear also how, like... These probably weren't like super professional voice actors. Oh no, God no! Yeah, I, I meant like the this the, like it's impre impressive how much like sound and you know like how alive the game is. Oh. God damn it! So it's it's that one, that one, then the probably the one next to it. Yes, noted. It sure is unfortunate that you have to use trial and error to fucking <laughs> cross this thing. It's a lot of dying. Man, I actually tried doing a. Uh, P pixel animation recently did you like this yeah 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 it's, it's, it's actually really interesting um a guy from capcom actually made a program that's like designed for doing it um, i can't remember the name of it off the top of my head but man it is it's something else it looks hard yeah i mean you can do the animation and like flash and then import it in and then go over it and all that i don't really talk about animation on the show much do i no mm. i do like animation uh, you, it's you, a thing i do you do it well mm, thank you uh wait Whoa, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Cedric! Son of a bitch! <laughs> he had that coming that, so hard. Oh, poor Cedric. <laughs> poor Cedric. Were uh, you supposed to save him? No, no, that's just... Huh? Hold on, let me have my Lord of the Rings moment here. Da Wait, Barry, play the music. Oh, yeah, so majestic. Let me get... Yes. <laughs> it's so good. All right. Okay, we're good, Barry. Uh, th thank music. you, Barry. Thank you. Um, uh, well. Oh, yeah. Time to sled it. Doesn't this seem very sled-like? I don't know. I'm thinking hammer. Let's do it. I'm, I'm thinking hammer. Yeah! Oh shit! Cool Woo! runnings up in this bitch. Just cause we're Jamaican doesn't mean we can't bob sled, man. Yeah! Oh, this is fun. <laughs> if, if this was a modern game, you know, there'd be like a quick time event or something. Oh, yeah, absolutely. It's like, we just chill and watch this. Yeah, I love it. He's, he's making some tight turns, too. Oh, yeah, damn. Oh, Whoa, didn't even make shit. that last turn. Did he die? I don't know. The sled died. No, nope, oh, we're fine. Rat. My sled is broken. <laughs> it's so dangerous sledding at two miles an hour. All right, let's save it here too. Oh, 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 oh! Jeez! All right, all right. This 
This guy just slays me. He has a sled? That's not how you spell that sleigh, Russ. You you mean this. Oops. Well, I don't know that. You right, guys spell it. check. Check. It's Shakua. Do you mean do you mean this kind of check? No, that's that's Czechoslovakian. I'm right. talking like well, check. No, we don't spell check like that. It's C H E Q U E. That's how you do it. Oh. Skad just slays me check. Yep, that's good. <laughs> Perfect. All right. We continue onwards. I love how when I get something wrong, I just like immediately put it like, mm, that's American English, My, no, your fault, yeah. not mine. Yeah. It's everybody else's fault. Oh, whoa. Like the whole quiche. Look at this majestic moment. fellow. A shivering eagle perches weakly upon a small rock. Despite his own problems, Graham's heart goes out to the poor thing. Rescuers down under. Ross, step away from the microphone, please. I can't hear what you're saying. That's the point. It's super annoying. <laughs> Maybe I can touch an eagle. Eagles love to be touched. The poor eagle gives Graham a pitiful look. <laughs> Graham would like to help him, but how? Uh, hammer. Not the hammer. Meat, maybe? He looks hungry. The pie. Was there happy? There we is go. This happy? I think this is happy. Here, take this. Perhaps it will help you. Aww. Whoa, now we can ride him. We can't ride- You can't just ride any animal you give food to, Ross. You are a kind man. Whoa! So oh, yeah, I love that everything her, talks! Especially up here in these snowy mountains. <laughs> well, I couldn't- do I it. have and lost it. <laughs> to death, what kind of person would I be? You have shown yourself to be a kind, compassionate man. It's like the, the most professional actor that I got was Wait, the guy to play the eagle. Like, I need to hear what he's saying. Uh, never mind then. Thank you, Ross. Well, they heard Super it. helpful. They, they heard it, but they're not the ones who need to know what to do now. Whatever, just just, just keep playing. Fucking Dingleberry. Alright. Oh, you know what? I think we'll continue this next time on Steam Train. Will we? I think so. Oh, good. Because, uh... Oh, wait. Well, let's just see what the next screen is. Okay. Oh, okay. It's wolves! It's wolves. It's wolves. Oh, oh shit. You. There. You are the master kin of wolves. Oh, shit. It's the Ice King. It's the queen. Queen Isabella, and you have entered my domain now. Oh, shit. I command you to kneel before me. I'd call her a hottie, but that wouldn't there. be correct. And so thoughtlessly invaded my territory without my permission or knowledge, I have decided you shall both be put to death. Oh. Take him away, my pet. You bitch. Whoa. <laughs> It's a doggy dog world. What the fuck? Wow. That wasn't cool at all. All right. Is that back enough? Back to this guy just slays me check. Yeah. All right. Is this, shall we? Shall we end the? Yeah. We'll, we're gonna. We'll, we'll, we'll cut ahead to next time on Steam Train, and then we'll get back to where we were. See you then, guys. Love you. Bye. Welcome back to Steam Train, everybody. Hey. Uh, hi. Hey. So we are in the snowy mountains. Uh, we just died. So now I'm gonna. Give that eagle a leg of lamb super quick. Uh, zip. Zip. And. Give him a juicy lamb. Yeah. Looks Dude, delicious. Oh my god, looks so good. Here, take, take it. And then we'll find out he talks like a guy from uh, Office Depot. Yeah. Thanks for the. You are kind, man. <laughs> with a poor bird, especially up here in these snowy mountains. Well, I couldn't. Well, blah, 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 blah. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it's okay. Well, uh, I watched it in between episodes, and he uh, he doesn't say anything. He just flies away. He just He's just like, I'll help you whenever you need it. Like every pivotal in point game. in the story, which yeah. you probably need to take care of. Yeah, probably soon. Um, okay. So, so this is the only way to do things. Like, yeah, you just walk. Yeah. So, there must be something that we have to do, like, after... It gives us a little time before the wolves get to me. So there must be something we need to do, like, in that period of time. Definitely the hammer. Yeah, throw the hammer at her. I I'm a bitch. I'm a queen bitch. So dickish. I command you to kneel before me. To both you and your friend over there. Did you just kneel? Yeah. Do you think I should be like, I'm a king? Suck it hard. I bow to no woman. Or man. Take him away, my pet. 
the elf ah. like, come at me, bro. Okay. Oh shit, you see, got one thing to do. What see, are you gonna do? Yeah, see, it does let me go to the inventory. Harp. Harp, you think? Power of music. Did you save before this? Yes. Okay. No, you didn't. Power of music! Power of music! Warning. Oh, it did work! Ross! Oh, dude, I just knew the power of music! You are on a fucking roll. Oh. Alright, let's watch this. Wait, my pet. Oh, yeah! Nailed it. Come on. Ross, you are a dick. Anything quite that beautiful before. So, I think I felt my heart melting just a little bit. You do it anything enough, later? Yeah, we don't well, hang out. Want to get freedom. an ice cream or? Oh, this is Jenny. Yeah, that's... the area. I'm taking up residence in my. Yeah, will, will coffee cave. kill you? Will you die from a hot so far, chocolate or I have been unable ice? to extricate him from either the cave or my territory. Oh. If you can rid me of the Yeti, I will release both you and your owl friend, and you two can continue on your journey unhindered. Okay. We have to get rid of the Yeti? We gotta kill a fucking Yeti. So if we get rid of the Yeti, will you have some spaghetti? With me? You will have my undying gratitude. Go with him, Sir Grey Wolf. Show him the way to the Crystal Cave. You may go now. Sir Grey Wolf will lead the way. Oh, alright. She's like Cuckoo Kachu, and she's got like dogs and yeah. knights. Cedric's like, Oh, I'll stay here! <laughs> Where it's safe! In the cage! <laughs> The oh. wolf's just like making aisle chat. Dude. So, you're a king? Yeah, you, uh. You ever been to the snowy cap mountains of death before? Or I... No. Dude, look at this fucking. Cool. These environments are awesome. Yeah, it's really cool. The, the, this was the first game where, like. Uh. I remember looking at it and being like, I wish I'd lived in this world, you know? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's just so fucking beautiful. Yonder is the crystal cave. There you will find the Yeti. Okay. Nice jet, dude. Yeah. See you later. All right, good talk. I think I will save it again. Because I'm about to fucking fight a Yeti. Oh, God, I wish this... Yeah, oh, you're so excited, Ross. <laughs> Yeti. Spaghetti. That's not how you spell spaghetti. <laughs> That's Yeti Spaghetti. But close enough. Alright. Um. Oh, is it over here? Where am I going? I think it's that cave over there with the, the thing. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, sorry. Do you need something to get the power music again? I don't know. We'll find out. Because I'm about to fight that fucker. Oh, damn. Oh, shit! Oh, my God, it looks like... Power of music! Power of music! Power of music! Okay. That, uh... What an abominable situation Graham found himself in. Okay. Power of music, unsuccessful. Okay, let's try the power of hammer. Power of hammer? I really don't think... Just based on what I know about Sierra games, I really don't think, like, a hammer is the way to do it. Okay, let me turn the speed all the way down. Oh yeah, slow fucking motion, bro. Ah, he's still fast. Okay, what do we got? Let's let's think it. Let's think this through, like in real time. All right. All right. We've so, got a key. We got a key. We got a custard pie. Got a custard pie. We have got the harp, which did not work. A bag, an amulet, my cloak, which I'm wearing, a hammer, hammer. the beeswax, the wand that has never worked. Okay. And a tambourine. Tambourine we already used. Hammer we already used. What about? This is just crazy. Yes. What about the custard pie? The custard pie? You want me to try it? I'll the custard pie once. If you're fucking right about the custard pie... I, I don't think I am, but I would like to see what a custard pie would... Too late, too late. Oh! It said too late, though. Too late? Like you were supposed... You were supposed to give it to him? I think so. You were? I think... Well, he wouldn't have said too late if uh, it wasn't the right thing. I can't... Do I really need to use a fucking pie? Ross, I swear there to God. There were in his face, and he'd be like, your pie in my face! I mean, that might actually be what it is. Oh, yeah, yeah. Get the pie ready. Oh! Yeah! Oh! 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 Ross is right! Ross wins! Yeah, he Ross just wins! Ross the fucking... Barry, put up a Ross wins! Ross wins! Wow. Dude, I cannot believe you fucking called two things in a row like that. 
can't believe we just killed a Yeti with a custard pie. pie. That's <laughs> awesome. I didn't remember that at all. Whoa. Damn. This is fucking awesome. He was hoarding beauty and majestics. Look at this. Brilliant crystals flashing and sparkling and reflecting off the numerous waterfalls caused Graham to gaze in awe and wonderment at the dazzling spectacle before him. Awe and wonderment, baby! I love it! Uh, let me take some crystals. One especially beautiful crystal catches Graham's notice in the center of the crystal cave. Oh, okay, this one. Oh, it's a flashing one. That's the one that's flashing over there. No, it's... It's but, in the center. But that one was flashing. As strong as he is, They're all even Graham can't break the stubborn crystal with his bare hands. Oh, hammer! Yeah, let's hammer it. Hammer time, bro. Stop! What? Hammer time. <laughs> yeah! So very gently, Graham hits the beautiful crystal. <laughs> so very gently, Graham bashes the crystal with a hammer. One piece. He then carefully places it among his other possessions. Awesome! Ross! Yeah. We're flying. We're yeah. cruising through this game. Yeah. I just like how many, like, different environments it puts you in. Oh, you know? yeah, it's great. Like, this, uh... I know I've said environments, like, five times, but I just love it, man. Like, we're in the snow-capped mountains. Mm -hmm. We're, uh... You know, we, we, we're in the forest. I'm sure we're going somewhere else now. It's just a real adventure. It really is. What's up, Wolfie? I love talking I animals. I see that the Yeti is dead. Queen Isabella will be pleased. Come, follow me. I'm gonna. Let's do it. It shows, like, the, the entire day's <laughs> journey back in real time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and all, all right. the idle chat. Yeah. Oh, they're doing it. Yeah. So, uh, how'd you kill the Yeti? Pie? Oh, custard pie. Yeah, that's uh, that's pretty standard. But yeah, pretty classic. Uh, pretty classic Yeti fare. Mmm. Oh, mm. I love it when the moon is out in the daylight. Yeah, that that's, is always beautiful. That's my favorite. You just look up and go, we've been there. <laughs> I mean, not we, but like, like five people. I meant humanity, dude. Oh, sure. We're all in it together. Still counts. All yeah. of all of mankind. We're all in it together. It doesn't matter about race, creed. Yep. There's one color. giant. Thing. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, good. You have returned in victory, I presume. Yes, Your Majesty. Nope, pushed out. Is dead. He will no longer be a scourge upon your realm. Are my friend and I free to go now? Yes. I keep my promises. I want to thank you for ridding my mountain domain of the horrible Yeti. Thank me with a pleasure. Rise, King Graham. Yes, I know who you are, and I have been informed of your quest. Mm -hmm. I do wish you luck against the Wizard Morda. Damn. You may go. We wish you well on your difficult journey. Sir Greywolf will show you the way out of the mountain. Cool. Cool. Come back later, because I do that thing where I give a blowjob with an ice cube in my mouth, so you kind of get that hot and cold. Okay, see ya! What? Oh, you never heard of that? I think I have, actually. It's pretty good. What is it? What does it feel like? Feels like hot and cold goodness. All over your your treasures. Neat. <laughs> yeah, it's the best. Oh, okay. I love walking this path with you, Wolf. <laughs> I feel like we've been through so much together. And then when you can't think of anything to talk about, there's that awkward silence, and both parties are like, I should really say something. Yeah. And then you both try to say something at the same time, and it's just yeah. super uh, awkward. Uh, oh, okay. Um, where do I go now? Aren't we just back here? Graham's duty's done. The large gray wolf now sits in silence, blocking the passage back to the Ice Queen's palace. Um... But that was can you go on the other side? There might be another side to the Yeti thing? Oh, we can go down. Whoa! Oh, that's confusing. Oh, I'm over here. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. This How did Cedric get to the other side? Well, he can fly. Oh. <laughs> Alright, this... This is gonna take some doing. Maybe? Maybe this will take doing? Yeah, I think we're better doing. Uh, okay, I'm gonna let, let's let's save it. Let's save okay. it. Yeti spaghetti spaghetti. <laughs> All right, go for it, Ross. Bird. 
I view. <laughs> okay, very good, Ross. Well done. God damn it. All right. Uh, we'll figure out how to get to Cedric next time on Steam Train, baby girl. I was talking to my baby girl. Oh. I don't actually have one, but... Oh. I mean, hypothetically. Mm-hmm. Later, baby girl. Welcome back to Steam Train, passengers. Hey, guys. Uh, Love you. So I gotta get up to Cedric here, who is perched that on that ledge. Wow. Yeah, so... Let's see if I can... What's with Wizards and Owls? Like, where did that start? I don't I know, know, like, Harry Potter, but, like, when was Harry Potter written? That's a good question. A poisonous hawk. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, it's the the what? Uh, it's a two-headed. It's a turkey vulture monster. Turkey. Did he just take me? Did he? Yeah. Cedric, like... you fucking dick. I had a long time to warn you. Yeah, nice warning, cocksmoker. Oh shit. Wow, Sierra has a theme oh. of like giant birds taking you. Hold on. Uh, that egg is hatching. Uh, Lots let's of bad things. Use the power music. First, I gotta grab that little glinty okay. thing. What is it? Brian what is it? rescues a lovely golden locket from the leafy clutches of the rock's nest. Oh, that's... quickly, 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 quickly! Ah! Ah! Oh my ah! god! This looks like what a fucking I... contraboss. Nice birdie. Good birdie. <laughs> uh, Gucci, Gucci, Gucci. <laughs> Smooth, Graham. Uh, Smooth. No, oh, wait. Hang on. I'll get you out of this. Oh, Eagle Friend! Oh, yeah. Eagle Friend. How very Lord of the oh, Rings. Oh, my God, they took your cloak. They took my cloak, you dicks. That's no joke. Oh, but that's okay, because I'm on a beach now. And there's a boat! All right! And a pole! Wow. See, I knew we'd go to a new type of world. Oh, Graham, where have you been? I've been looking all over for you. Fuck off, you, you have. You piece of you'd dog shit. you never believe it, Cedric. You'd never believe it. You'd certainly never believe it because you don't do anything Hey, talking Al! Yeah. You'd never believe it! <laughs> yeah, right, Jesus. Let's see what this is. It's pretty obviously a thing. <laughs> Ta telling the talking Al in a monocle and vest that he wouldn't believe anything. Yeah, right? Just... What is that? The heavy iron bar is a bit uh. rusted from being out in the weather. Okay. Might be for fishing and or a controlling a boat. On a delicate chain. Okay. Let me see this locket. Upon opening the locket, Graham sees a portrait of an older couple in regal attire. So as not to damage the picture, he quickly closes it again. And puts it deep within his butt. <laughs> All right, <laughs> let's move on. It would be lovely to make, like, a, a pretty fucking hilarious if someone made, a, like, an adult's humor... Oh yeah, adventure game like that, just like s the stupidest solutions, like putting shit in your butt. I agree. To the front of the unusual house. Um, I feel there's gonna be a Kickstarter for that eventually. <laughs> hello, hello. Hi. The door, but he finds it bolted from the inside. Mm. He can, however, hear activity within. Yeah, yeah, he's probably jacking it. Let's hit that bell. <laughs> oh, oh shit. <laughs> Hello? Wasn't jacking it. Who are you? <laughs> what are you doing on my beach? <laughs> I'm King Graham of Daventry, and I'm on a journey to find the wizard Mordax Island. But I seem to be stuck. I don't know where to go from here. Whatever! Hey, what's that you say? Oh. Good talk, what, what, Dick. What? Is he deaf? I guess he's deaf. Wait. All right. So, oh, maybe you have to hit him in the head with a pole. N that's not what you do with deaf people, Ross. Speak louder. All right, I'll. <laughs> we'll just uh, go towards that boat. Yeah, we'll... that sounds like you. Yeah, I'm sure there's something we have to do to make him like not as deaf. Get away from the old goat and get on the boat. There's a boat here. Maybe we can use it. Maybe we can use it. Maybe we can, Cedric. Maybe you can stop talking like a dick. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. It's all you, Ross. Use. And. Ab use and abuse. All right. Thank you, Ross. How very fucking tailored to this one situation. An old cast-off sailboat sits forlornly on the narrow sandy beach. All right. Let's do it. Let's ride, my friend! Da, 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 da. That was super fortunate that wow. that was there. Come on, Cedric, get in the boat! Except the sail is pointing the wrong know, direction. Captain. Yeah, good point. Oh, that's right. Oh, oh, oh! Wait, what, what happened? 
Maybe you're supposed to put the metal pole on there to control it. No. What the fuck? Did Graham... Wait, did, did Cedric get on the boat? That boat sucked. Well, Cedric could fly away, because he's uh, an owl. Well, I mean, like, what happened? Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. What about the metal pole? The sailboat sits forlornly on the narrow sandy beach. Try the metal pole. Oh. I think that the metal pole might be, the, like, the, the obvious. The rod? Wait, well, the... That won't help Graham with Okay, the what was the thing, the blue thing you had there? Go, go back. What's the blue thing? To the, the locket? Oh. oh, this is the crystal. This is the piece mm, of crystal. It wouldn't... Let's see. That won't help Graham Because I think the... we don't have a rudder or a, or a paddle or something to reinforce the boat. Let's try that. The crystal and the wand? I doubt it. Nope. Nope. No. Um, what about the... Oh, there must be a, le a leak in the boat. So what about the wax? Oh, the beeswax. Yeah. That yeah. might work. Thank you. Yes, Ross, you're a genius. Firmly, Graham wedges the softened piece of beeswax into the small hole in the boat's hull. Hopefully, the wax will hold and make her seaworthy. Yes. Okay. Hop on in, Cedric. You probably won't die this time. Come on, Cedric, get in the boat. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> okay. Um, now, if I recall correctly... Is there a Chimera water monster? There is. There's a, oh! there's, a, there's a big fucking sea serpent somewhere. Great! Yeah. Ow. Is that bad for us? Of course it's bad. It'll kill us. But we have to... We Stab have to, it. No. We have Save. to... Save. No. Play. Oh, wait. Just speed. Yeah, there we go. Okay. We need to find Harpy's Island. Oh my god, this is a fucking Wind Waker flashbacks, right? I know. <laughs> Fla flashbacks, flash present, flash forward. It's flash dancing. Flash dancing. Flash animation. Um. I guess if we. Oh, there uh, it is! Hey! Sweet! I don't know. Batman? They're not- not everything Gargoyles! Oh no, they're harpies. Oh. Hey, girl. Are they straight up look like they're going to be on the beach. Isn't he Thank you, I am luscious. Oh, no. He doesn't look like my type. What do you think, Rubina? I think he looks tall and tough. I like my meals to be yummy yeah, there is. dinner. While they're bickering. While keeping a sharp eye out for the harpies, Graham quickly bends down and rescues the fish hook from the ground. It's a fish hook. Yes, you did. I saw you steal a man off a raft. Just Can you just walk away while they're arguing? Yeah, right? I don't think so. Why don't we construct a rifle? <laughs> a rifle out of a fish hook and a hammer? But we just, like, put the, the fish hook in between our, like, um, our middle finger and our ring finger and then we become a raptor that's a great and idea we, at it, their throats in the meantime i think i'm gonna save it as good an idea as that is and I, i'm sure we'll execute it flawlessly raptor skills yeah good idea uh-oh uh-oh uh -oh. our hands accidentally just touched everybody ah oh, ross it feels gross no stop touching me stop 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 stop, stop. out of context that's gonna sound hilarious it's gonna say oh did i just die while you were fucking- God damn it, Ross! This is why you can't creepily touch me during games. Alright, I have to do something while they're arguing. Fucking stab him! In the throat! With what? The raptor hook! The fish hook? Yeah, they'll get, like, it caught in their mouth. Throw something at them. Play music! Power of music! Yes! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> That's the answer to everything in this game. It's like, fuck, what do we do? Play some mad tunes, bro. Yeah. Oh. Hey, what's up here? They want the tunes, man? Oh, they want those hot tunes. All right, let me get the fuck out of here. Why did she not like it? No, she loved it. And she wanted she it? She was like, I want this harp. This is mine now. What a bitch. 
Because they're harpies. Oh. Oh, hey, Cedric's dead. Oh, nice. Poor Cedric. Having been seriously wounded by the vicious harpies, he now lies moaning and in pain upon the sandy path. Aww. I just like got a boo boo. Oh, my whole spine is broken. <laughs> Help me. Aww. That is sad. Oh, poor guy. Cedric, where do you hurt? All of the places. Everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I broke my monocle. Yeah. Oh, Cedric. No! Oh, Cedric dies. That's gonna be pretty sad. I'm gonna be super sad if Cedric Dude. dies. I don't seem to remember him dying, though. Well, that looks important. Yeah. Can you put him in the boat first. Yeah. You just toss Cedric into the ocean? Like, oh, a thing! Like, it, you put him in the boat and then shoot an arrow, a flaming arrow at him and have, like, a Viking funeral? <laughs> <laughs> Push him out of the ocean? I'm still alive! Wait, I. <laughs> Shut up, Cedric! Burn! <laughs> uh, oh, it was a conch. Oh. Graham can almost hear the ocean inside the spiral shell of the is it conch or conch? I don't. I, think I, I don't. Sure. I don't know either. I don't know either. All right. Uh, I'm not a marine bi biologist. Cedric is dying. It's really fucked up. Whatever, buddy. Look at this flower. <laughs> Super distracted by everything. I just want to make sure there's nothing up here. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well. There sure isn't any more! Looks like we answered that one. Okay. Um, alright, we're oh, gonna- shit. Yeah. Oh, shit, was jam again. We're gonna get back to where we were. That was funny. Uh, <laughs> Is there anything over here? You killed both of us. Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah! Oh, it's so good! Amazing! Blip? I don't know, but I want it! You bitch! Later, slut. Did you ever watch Gargoyles? Yeah, it was a really good show. Yeah, it was awesome. How'd the theme song go? Don't know. Yeah, I don't remember. <laughs> gargoyles, gargoyles. <laughs> Graham! Shut up. I've got you. And let me grab this conch. <laughs> and we are crying. I have to eat the owl. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it left me with a bad note. I didn't know what to do. Oh, no. We have to replace one of our older games. Uh, uh, cancel. Uh, oh, my God. Wait, was there too much room? Yeah, we, we've... we've. There's only a limited amount of savey places. Oh, my God. So let's replace Don't, Don't Cry, Cry Guy, Guy with... With... Don't... Die, guy. <laughs> Nicely done. All right, next time on Steam Chain, we'll save our little owl friend. Yay! Yay! Welcome back he to the Steam Chain. Oh, okay, all right, all right, all right. I can't take it anymore. We've been listening to that, like, little interstitial theme song for the past, like, 20 minutes while Ross got a sandwich and tinkled in other sorts of situations. Okay. I, I tingled with my sandwich. I regretted it. <laughs> it, was a, it was a bad idea. Uh, oh! Okay! Damn. Note to self! Watch out for Charizard. Shiny Charizard. Jesus, man. Okay. Don't die, guy. We should have taken our own advice. God damn it, this song! Alright. Note to self, don't go south. South is bad. Alright, dude, enough. Enough. <laughs> Let's go back to the other island, because I, I think I have an idea. Check this out. Chick chickity check this out. Ross, I want you to answer a little riddle for me. What's up? And you tell me if you think I'm on the right course here. Okay. Um, what? You, that, that little conch shell we got? Yep. What are they known for? Uh, they are known for the hearing impaired. They are not, well... I was gonna say you can hear the ocean in them, but yeah, I bet that's what it is. We give the conch to this guy. You still here? Yeah, dick. Please help me. Take I this conch. How did you call me? I can't hear you. Can't understand a thing you said. Gotta speak up, boy. Now get out of here. Just jam it in his ear. Uh. Boom. What's this? Now what were you wanting? My owl friend is hurt. 
He was wounded by the harpy. You get like right into the shell. You're like, my old friend, friend is hurt. <laughs> like blow his mind out. <laughs> yeah, that is a nice shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, cool. He's gonna heal. He's gonna heal our boy Seds. Is he peeing? No, that's his beard. Oh, oh. Yeah. These portuses should fix the little fella up. Good as new. Oh, Cedric. Is he flying to his dick? Yeah. Oh, my dick! Ooh, I'm feeling better already. Tell me, what was in those poultices? My employer would be very interested in them. Hey, what was that? I said, what was in those poultices? My employer would be interested in them. Gifts from the sea, lad. Gifts from the sea. Ain't nothing special. You just gotta know how to use them. I don't think he'd find them particularly interesting. Alright. No, son. Aww. What was it you were trying to tell me before? I was trying to Graham is pretty jacked for a 55 year old. Yeah, man. He kidnapped my family and is holding them hostage there. I must get to them before it's too late. Oh, I'm right sorry to hear about that. He's a nasty one, that Mordak. I wouldn't want to tangle with him. I tried to talk you out of going there, except I can see you can't leave your poor defenseless family unaided. I can enlist someone who can lead you straight to his island. That's what I'm talking oh, about. What is he enlisting? He's gonna get some. He's gonna get us a guide to the wizard, the evil wizard's uh, island. Oh my god! Yeah. Yeah. Get over. Oh, oh hey! Damn. damn, girl. I was expecting a bird. He needs you to lead him to Mordax Island. It's a real emergency. Mordax holding his family hostage. Girl can't speak human talk. But she's agreed to help you. Just get on <laughs> in. She knows her way around a sweet handy, Jay. I want to thank <laughs> you for all your help, Mr. Uh... Don't worry about who I am. You just get on over to that there island. And Fortbeard! <laughs> Clarence <laughs> Fortbeard! <laughs> Come on, Cedric. Let's get after that big titted mermaid. <laughs> Quickly. Her titties will provide us with great buoyancy. Uh, oh, look yeah. at her go. Yeah, damn. Why do they always have bikini tops? That never made sense know. to me. You should just have straight up nips. Yeah. Let those baps free, lady. Mm -hmm. Free like the sea. Oh, shit. This does look like a last board type of situation. I love you said board. It's so cute. Oh. <laughs> yes. It really dates your, 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 the time you started playing games. I know. So, someone on the subreddit yeah. asked why I say board. Mm. And uh, someone was like, it's because he's from a different time. Like when grandma says something racist at dinner. <laughs> Oh my god, I have the best, like, you story right? like that, uh, but I'm not sure how I can tell it without it being super racist. Okay, let's- But, but I can tell it, I can right. tell it. Um, Wait, let's just hear what he has to say first. Okay, okay. yeah. Um, oh, okay. okay, so I'll, 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 I'll use the- I can say N-word, do you think that's fair? Uh, well, you can say the, the phrase N-word. Okay, uh, alright. I okay. feel really bad telling a story, but it's, it's, it was actually really funny. I just got another fish. Um, sweet. So, my grandmother was dying, and she was about 98 at the time. Okay. And So um, she was from a different era. She was from a different era. Yeah. And, uh, like, she was in Ireland, and, I, and my, my cousin went to go check up on her, making sure she was, you know, good. She was, she was dying, and, um, she, she had a caretaker who was, um, he was, uh, an African Irish fellow. Oh, and, um... Every time she wanted his attention, she'd go like, "Enward, Enward, come over here, Enward." Oh my god! And, we're, and like my my cousin's like, "Granny, you can't be saying that." And she's oh like, my god. Well, "That's what he is, and that's what I'll call him." Oh and we were just my like, god! Granny, you can't be saying that. Stop! Yeah. Stop! Yeah. Like it was. She's just. They just just it's didn't just, understand. Yeah, it was just impossible for them to relate. I just, it, it was. It was a, a different time. Yeah, a, a shittier, shittier time. Go right ahead. Uh, castle. Oh, there you go, Ross. <laughs> Very creative. Um, but yeah, no, right, I mean, it, it, it is interesting, like, how far, like, society- Whoa, 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 okay. Society is kind I don't know if I survived that. It looks like the eyes have it. Oh, well, nice. Nice time to start busting out the puns, dick. I feel that they've used that pun before in a different Sierra game. Uh, have they? I don't know. Like what? in Space Quest? What the hell am I gonna do? Oh, use the the, the magic what protector. The wand? Oh, no, the crystal! The crystal! The crystal will reflect it back! Oh, I bet you're right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is very never-ending story. Um, where do I put it? Here? 
No, 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 like, oh, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah! Oh! Yes! Damn! Suck it, serpents! Good job, Ross. Thanks, man. Fucking, you're really good at Sierra games. Apparently, I just didn't open my mouth before because I thought you knew what to do. You were fucking garbage at Space Quest and Leisure Suit I was Larry. not, but I think I learned. I learned the, the kind of the mindset the designer was in. Well, you know? it looked like there's no way in. Let's turn back. Shut up, pussy. On, God, it's getting intense. I'm sweating. I know, dude. This is this is when shit gets real. Because you know everything here is going to be able to kill you. Oh, no question. And then anything you missed three hours ago is probably going to kill you. No, Graham, don't. <laughs> God damn it. That was a fucking hole. Yeah, I that, thought that was a step. That was not. Boy, Cedric really knows how to fucking warn you just in time. Okay. Uh, let's do that crystal thing again. Boy, these... These, uh... Those falling deaths really are funny. Okay. Alright. Let's see. So we, we just can't go up that front way. Mm. Is that a side path, maybe? I don't think I ever got this far. It looks like there's no way in. Let's turn back. Oh, why don't you grow a set, you freaking owl? Yeah. This definitely feels very like Dark Crystal right now. Oh, for sure, dude. I love it. Dark Crystal was only like six years old when this came out. Oh, yeah. Good point. Man, I can see why Holly likes this game. She yeah. fucking loves Dark Crystal. Of course, me and too. And elves. Yeah. And Harry Potter. <laughs> Is this game made for Holly? No. Yeah, right? No. Figure this out. Figure it out. All right. Um, maybe pull on this grate? Graham tugs hard on the grate, but soon finds it's rusted in place and can't be budged. Um... Uh, use the hammer. Bar. Well, yeah, I mean, the back of a hammer would technically do it, but... Maybe. That would... Maybe? Yeah, alright. Yeah, alright, cool. It'll probably break afterwards. You're probably right. Oh, no? No? Really? Wait. No, I might have loosened it enough. Yeah, nice, alright, cool. Go. Oh, clever. Neat. So we're keeping it there to keep it up. Yes. Ooh, you're crazy to go down into that dark hole. You don't know what's down there. Well, do we have? Oh, did we bring that? Well, do we have a flashlight or a? Uh, what do you mean a flash? Flashlights don't exist here. No, I mean, I mean like oh, a, right. a torch. Oh, okay. I don't, I, see, I would call a, tor a flashlight a torch, but you then I get confused now and call torches tor torches flashlights. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Like I, uh, I understand. Know what I, mean. I gotcha. Bye, Morda. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this is very... Okay. You know what? Yeah? I hate to cut this steam train off at exactly ten minutes, but this is an incredibly confusing maze. Um, oh, okay. I've never actually gotten this far, but uh, my friend did, and I watched him get lost in this shit for hours. Really? Yeah. I, you, so, let's save the game yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh... Durzant's in my pants. Oh, oh remember no. those? Remember those nice days when all we had to worry about in this game were ants? Yeah. In, in our pants. Shit's gotten so real since then. Wait, D is still there. Oh, okay. Durz. Gra. Durz Graham, in m maze. Yeah, Durz Graham in maze. Cool. All right. I'm gonna look this up because, I mean, just to give you an example. Yeah. Ugh. And that looks like it would kill you. Yeah. See, this is... Ugh. Well, now we have to... Oh, you're going to reload it just to start from the Yeah, beginning. yeah, yeah. Th th this is the kind of shit that Konami we'll code. Be... Yeah, exactly. Oh, that looks like the exit. It does, except you get there, and it's just more of the shit. You know, what? it's... What? Yeah, it's just... The layout is super confusing. Is there, like, a top-down map of it or something? Oh, that looks good. Uh, oh, no, no, no. Oh, maybe to the left. Wait, no, the right. Okay. God damn this. Oh, no. I mean, this is walkthrough city right here. No one gains anything from it. Oh, God. Uh, I think we're going good. Are we? Ah! Oh! Is he what you were looking for? I don't know. What are you? A huge beast sporting a fluffy top knot bound in a crude hairpin on top of his head. Give him a pie. Uh, okay. uh, do we still have the pie? Oh, he threw it. Yeah, the fish. The rotting fish. Let's see. Do you like fish? Makes no impression on the huge beast. Okay, what about um the the locket? Let's. Ooh. 
What about the... It makes no imp- No, that was the, that's the magic one. The locket. The, the one that's at the left oh. of it. Yeah. You think he's interested in the locket of an old elderly couple? No, no, okay. How about, how about we realistically- Tam Tambourine? Tambourine. He's a monkey! Yeah! He'd love, he'd love tambourines. Yeah, he's Yay! a monkey! Yeah, he's right, he's a monkey! He's happy. Oh, look at him grooving! Oh, wow. He, 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 and he dropped a thing. Can you pick it back up? Let's see what that thing is. Because, I mean, technically monkeys, you know, like the, the like little monkeys you get with the, the, the little musical instruments. Down and grab yeah, the, the little toys. The yeah. floor. What did we get? Oh, it's a key. Oh. Is it? The hairpin. Oh, no, it's a hairpin. Well, obviously we've done something right, should we say? Let's save it just in case. But... We won't save it over the other thing. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. We'll just... Where's the other one? Oh, it's up at the top. Oh, it gets moved to the top. All right, all right. Okay, so water sucks Gatorade rules. Everybody knows it. Thanks. Thanks? <laughs> well, thanks for watching this episode of Steam Train. And uh, we'll continue this crazy maze next time. Love you. Later. Peace. Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to the mysterious dungeon. Steam. Of Steam Train. Train. And King's Quest V. King's Quest V. What a game, I hope Dan. You've, I hope you've what been enjoying game. this. I've been loving this. Have you? I, I, my, my, honestly, my favorite part of doing this show with you is sitting down and playing these old games, which I probably would never play otherwise. Yeah, it's, uh, it's just fucking It's fun. a trip. And I'm lost. I'm hopelessly lost. Did you memorize the direction? I did, but we have to start off. <laughs> really? You've <laughs> yeah. ruined it already? I'm sorry. Oh, no. Okay, was... this, this, by the way, guys, this maze is apparently really hard. It's super weird. We lucked out in the last episode and found one of the gorilla monkey things that we needed to find, but I guess it's still confusing if you lose track of where you're going. Yeah. So Dan kind of needs to concentrate to remember the directions he needs to go. Truth. So... True dad. Ross, man. Uh, oh, that looks creepy. Yeah, that's. I'm sure that's fine. Is that a? Yeah. Oh, we you found, found the exit. Okay. Whew. There is a wooden door here. Perhaps it will lead into the castle. Cool. Just a hunch. Can we turn that uh, volume up a little on his voice, maybe? Oh, it's. It's. I'm sure it's loud enough. I. I can't hear it. You can't hear it. There we go. There we go. Thank you, Miss Ross. Okay. Graham tries to open the wooden door, but to no avail, as it's securely locked. Son oh, no. of a bitch. Do you have a key? Uh, use the... use the hammer. That's... <laughs> like all problems, let's bash That won't work with the labyrinth door. Okay, oh, right? well, that's uh, your opinion. Yeah. I'll use the hairpin that we got from the gorilla. Oh, from the giant if thing. You can use it to yeah. lockpick. Ah! Ah! Oh yeah, nailed it. Looks like he's rubbing Graham his hands together. the hairpin into the door's large keyhole and discovers, to his amazement, that it fits perfectly. Yeah. Turning it ever so like gently, he soon hears a soft click and the door is unlocked. Click. Oh, Boom. this is going to be something behind this door, something really bad. I, no, I don't think so. Well, let's see. Maybe. I mean, we're dead. Yeah. Oh, we did it. We're in Mordak's castle now. We're burglars! We are. A set of wide steps leads up from the labyrinth door to a pantry off the wizard's kitchen. Oh, the pantry. Let's make a bagel! Oh, Ross, I... The pantry catches <laughs> Graham's interest. <laughs> oh, okay. It captured our interest. No, oh, let's go look at it! Let's... Yeah, let's see what happens. Inside the cupboard, Graham's eyes fall upon a bag of dried peas. Heh <laughs> Oh! Peas, Let me get them peas, peas girl. Reaching into the open cupboard, oh, all over me. retrieves the bag of dried peas. I mean, don't look at me like that. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna look at you every time you say anything that weird. What? Like Graham scans the various items you like lining baby? the open shelves. What's wrong with but doesn't see anything of interest. Okay. This is important. We're we're in the fucking wizard's castle now, man. We've worked so hard to get here. I know. Let's not talk about pee loudly over the information. Oh, well, who's this girl? Oh. Is that, that your wife? No, no. Oh. Is it his wife? Hold on. A lovely young girl with long black hair, olive skin, and flashing green eyes laboriously scrubs the cold stone floor. Though wearing rags, her beauty nevertheless shines through. What do you mean? 
What, what do you mean, is that my wife? Is that his wife? I don't know. Like, I, don't I don't know. have a wife, Ross. I thought you did. You had kids and shit. I don't. No, King Graham does. Yeah, that's what I meant. I didn't mean you, stupid. I would never hurt you. I'd like to help you. I don't believe you. You're probably one of them. I'm not. Believe me. Calm your tits. Just go away. Please. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Okay, she's too scared. Hammer. Wait, no, don't use the hammer. No, to, to help her get the dirt off the floor. <laughs> Maybe she'd like some peas. Oh, pee all over her. <laughs> Take that away from me. I don't want it. Okay, try the, um, the, 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 um, the, oh, the amulet with the little picture in it. Better some, no, not that amulet, it's the magic amulet. There's a difference. Oh, the locket. Yeah, maybe she knows the person in it. Oh, that's true. Oh, oh yeah. Ross fucking... Morning. I just got, got it. Just got it. Got it. Got it. Nailed it. Nailed it. Let's watch it. Wherever did you find my gold locket? Damn. I thought it was gone for good. I, started with I porn. left it on the island just after I was brought here by Mordak. How will I You wouldn't repay? believe me even if I told you. But tell me, who are you? And how did you come to be here? My name and is. And how are you still wearing Kena, makeup? From the kingdom of the Greenland. My father, the king, employed the horrible wazir who befriended Mordak. When Mordak saw me, he immediately wished to marry me and bring me here. Uh, that was right! Uh, Naturally, I refused. And my father agreed with me. But our refusal angered him so much that he stole me here anyway and put me to work as a scullery girl. He says he will never let me go. That a scullery girl I will remain until I agree to marry him. My arm is getting tired. <laughs> but the thought revolts me. What am I to do? <laughs> it looks like he's just been lo looking at her cleavage the Don't whole time. Don't worry. Yeah. I'm here to save my so family bad. from the evil wizard. He's got them here someplace, imprisoned inside a glass bottle. If I can manage to rescue them, then of course I wouldn't forget you either. I know the glass bottle you're talking about. It's in Mordak's laboratory upstairs. Oh shit. Keep quiet about my presence. Uh, I think this will be the most difficult part of my journey. I may not survive it. I would never give you away. And I will help you in any way I can, I kind trust sir. Her. No, she's she's actually a very important character in King's Quest VI. Oh, really? Yeah, I didn't realize it was her. By the way, who are you? I'm King Graham of Daventry. Baby. I think I know where that is. It's very far from my home, though. Don't worry. Somehow, I'll get you home again. But cool. first, I've got to save my family. Let's do it. Yes, well... I'll stand by you, King Graham. I'll help if I can. Thanks. I may need it. Well, I'd better get back to work. And you should keep out of sight. Aye, aye, my lady. It's not like I'm wearing neon mint green tights or anything. No, no. It's fine. All right, so let's let's say this to spot because we've we've made some progress. Uh, so... Yeah, you, you gotta remember we have to replace things, because yes. we ran out of space. So let's replace... This, the, the files are too much for this, 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 this future computer. It's true. Alright, go for it, Ross. Um, uh, fi fu future... Future com... Compute... Future comput. Thank you, Ross. Very, very fucking specific to this one situation, and I... I can't thank you enough. So she's gonna... She's gonna the be, shit out of that floor? No, she's gonna oh. be the love interest of your, uh, of your son. In, son? Yeah. A hideous, yet fascinating How pipe organ work? commands attention as Graham walks through a downstairs hallway. Ooh. Whoa. She, wanna play it? Yeah. Hit the buttons. <laughs> play, um, play Spanish Flea. I love that song. Okay. Whoa. Graham watches in horrified fascination as the grotesque organ begins to magically play an eerie tune. All by itself. <laughs> Ooh. Spooky. Spooky scary. Oh my god, it's like the um Werewolf Bar Mitzvah? No, it was like uh, we went to Magic Castle here uh -huh. in LA and like they had a piano that played itself. Oh, and yeah. you could tell the piano like what it, you wanted it to play. And I like walk everyone's like, oh my god, play Lady Gaga. And it's like it's obviously a guy behind somewhere right. controlling it. And I was just like, hey. 
could you play Super Mario? And he's just, and like, there's like this long pause, and then he said, and he was like playing like all these different like Mario songs for like ages, and I was just like, yes, this guy is obviously That's awesome. a Mario fan. Oh, oh shit! Fuck. Goodbye, King Graham of Daventry. <laughs> Whoa. Maybe we shouldn't have alerted him. Yeah, okay, that was apparently a terrible idea. <laughs> oh. Why is he dancing? He's not dancing. He's Did he just fucking Darth Vader choke him? He just, yes. Son of a bitch. All right, fuck him. Future compute. Yeah. Wow, so <laughs> we were like, this is the toughest part of my journey. We have to be really quiet. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I may not survive. <laughs> and then we went into the played an organ and died. We we're like, yeah, piano. <laughs> All right, okay. We're just gonna waltz right by this thing. Yep, yeah, it's a death trap. Little fucking bastard. Look at that head. Ah, just following me. Creepy, creepy. Quite creepy indeed. Okay. So the only thing I remember about this is yeah. we, we- He has a cat, mm -hmm. and we can't get seen by the cat, because the, the cat, cat is actually a person. The table has been placed before a large, ornate fireplace. The, the cat's the guy your son turned into the cat. Has been right. Before a large, ornate fireplace. Alright. Guess I will leave. Ting. And there's the cat. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Is that bad? Yeah, it's super bad. Alright, we'll do this next time on Steve Train. Really? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Bye. For now. Well, good day. And welcome back. G'day, mate. Oh, Jesus. Welcome back to Mordex Castle. We are wandering around here. Learning the ways of the force. Not so much the force, but this is a creepy castle, and we gotta kind of sneak around. Oh, look at that lady. She's like a snake dragon woman. She is. Graham gaped at an odd figure of a bird-like, yet reptilian-like woman. That's kind of what I said, except not. Right. Graham gaped at an odd... Okay. Graham looks in astonishment around the strange foyer filled with an assortment of bizarre oddities. Oh god, the thing on the right looks like a weeping angel. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not into oddities. God damn oh, god. it, cat! Ah! Uh. Did it see you? I don't know. Should we run? I don't know. Should we speed up? I don't know. Should we go in that closet and hide? Hold on, let's... Maybe it'll be gone. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Okay, cool. okay, is that bad? No, it's good. I don't think he spotted us. Can he just enter the room at any time? Can who enter the room? The, the cat, or does it only enter when you when you when you is? Well, it uh, it won't enter the room while you're in there, right? I don't think so. Okay. I believe we're looking for, if I remember this correctly, we're looking for like a large blue monster. What? Yeah, because we have to get thrown in the blue man group in the dungeon. No. Goodbye. The cat sauce. <laughs> Son of a bitch! If you played this game the first time, you'd probably be wondering, like, why am I dying? Why does this keep happening? Yeah. The Sierra games, I mean, like, you really do- Okay, I got it. We're gonna turn up the speed a little bit. You really do have to, like, know, like, two or three certain things. About the story? Like, the fact that the cat is not really a cat? Yeah, and just, like, just that you can't do this one thing because it'll screw you much later. You know, like, it wasn't always clear with Sierra- Fuck. It was all about foresight, wasn't it? Yeah. Fuck you, cat. Seriously. I'm tired of your dickatry. I love the fucking walking animation. <laughs> okay. Like, how are you supposed to, like, have, like, foresight for a cat? Just randomly appearing in the room. Well, you know he's bad news. Ah! Oh! Oh, okay, that is the blue monster we discussed. Oh my god. That's the one that scared your wife. Really? Yeah, Holly t was talking to you about a blue monster. I was like, what are they talking about? Woof. The fuck was god that about? God damn. That is unnerving. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's a little oh, mouse. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. All right, what have we learned about mice? That they, they are... have laser vision. Not so much that, Ross, mm -hmm. but that they are important in this game. Okay. So, let's see. Graham finds himself in a dirty, dingy cell somewhere below Mordak's castle. I want to see if we can get on the, the mouse hole. Yes. Oh, okay. 
Graham can see a small, moldy piece of cheese just inside the mouse hole. Gross. We got cheese. We got cheese, baby. Cheese, please. Give me that cheese. Graham finds that his hand is too large to reach very far into the small mouse hole. Mm. Use a skeleton hand. No, that's that's also Use a the hand. fishing hook. Oh, that's not a bad idea, actually. Let's try that. Tie the fishing hook to something. Oh, oh, okay, I guess it worked. There, got it. The fish hook did the trick in retrieving the piece of cheese from the mouse hole. <laughs> this is the kind of thing where, like, oh, what the oh. fuck? Hey, girl. Hi, girl. What? What's up, bitch? No, don't where call her a bitch. I mean, she's not a bitch. She's a lovely lady. I spend a lot of time down here, you know, with my friends. Friends? Yes. Like, Dink and Sam. I don't know if you ever saw Sam or not. Anyway, I found this loose stone once that led here, to this cell. Are the rats Now come on, friends? you better yeah, get she's out of here. <laughs> it's like, oh, you're wacky. I like you. <laughs> she's in some crazy shit. Yeah. Well, no, Dink is that big gorilla thing whose hairpin oh. we got. Yeah, his name is Dink. Oh. Much like your jacked nerd friend. Oh, Dinkles. Yeah, Dinkles. They might be related. <laughs> awesome. God no oh I have to follow her exactly. Uh oh. Oh my god, this is a little bit unfair. I probably should have read what to do. No, I probably should have turned it slower because she's gone. Are you serious? Her ass is gone, bro. Did you save this shit? Yeah, I mean No. Uh, no you didn't. Alright. Barry. Hit the fast forwards. Okay, we're back. We're back. Um, and we slowed that girl down. Yes, we're, her lovely lady. Everything is very slow. Beautiful so girl. We will have. We will follow her right now. Okay, let's let's go. Uh... Oh, this is very slow. <laughs> well, we put it in slow motion because we didn't want her to get away from us because she was too fast. <laughs> Ross, what is wrong with you, dude? Stop lying on me. She's too fast. Oh, this is. She's like Sonic. She's just the like. Oh, Jesus. She's so fucking fast, dude. Unreal. Wait, that was slow. Why are you turning it up? Uh, well, she, we had it on slow, and she just blew, blew right away. Bet she did. All right. Um, oh my god. How do we keep up with that madness? What? She's gone. She's already gone. Now what? What the, the fuck? fuck? I think she went up. Why is she like a speed no, I demon? She, I think she went up. I think I saw. She's like appears like for like one frame for every. The the is it, she's uh, gone. She's gone. Oh! All right, restore. All right, we're gonna try this one more time. Show yourself, baby. Why did she do that? Follow me. I'm gonna. If you just allow me the opportunity. Opportuni the opportunity. Ah! She went right, left, left. She went that way. <laughs> that one I got, Ross. We we've got that one down. Okay. Why are you turning it down? Well, let's see what happens. Maybe, maybe, maybe she'll be slower. Okay, I'm uh... watching really quick and I'm not blinking. Nope, I didn't see gone. anything. Go she's up. Gone. Go up. Okay. Why our arms look like this? Okay, I don't know. I was just. Sometimes I just want to be close <laughs> to you. I just wanna be. This is super frustrating. Look how slow we are. We're like uh, a slow uh, motion move, uh, man. Uh, uh, I don't think that was no. the right direction. God damn it! This is impossible. Damn. All right, learn how to play King's Quest. You're well, right, I thought Ross. you were the, ki the king is, of this. This is completely my fault. Yeah. I have one last idea. What's your last idea? And then idea? I'm just gonna check a goddamn thing. Maybe it's the speed that's uh that's like locked in now that she's reacting to later do you know what i'm saying oh like we're too slow and she's too fast no i'm saying mm -hmm. like we're trying to change the speed after the fact that she's already spawned right but maybe it's the speed that we have locked in when we have this conversation that she reacts to or maybe she's just an asshole maybe she's just an asshole most people when they try like, to leave follow me! <laughs> most people you follow through a maze are gonna wait for you you're absolutely right. Okay. Okay. Don't go fast. Stop going so fast! Oh my god, she is. Um, try the worst. going up. We haven't gone up before. Alright. If you could, any minute now. I don't think it allows you to. It's pretty slow. 
Uh, 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 it's turning into walls. Oh, there you go. Yep. Oh, good. And uh, I guess lost she, she went left. Left. Oh, we might as well turn the speed back up because who knows where the fuck we are right now. Can you figure your way out without her? Nope. Oh, what was that? That was like a little spidery monster thing. Oh, are they bad? They're not bad, they're just nothing. They're just background. They're just there to fucking fuck What the with heck whoa, is this? What the fuck is that? Hit, right. hit the button. Oh. Oh, good. <laughs> we made our way back to the dungeon. Did we really? Oh. oh. All right, Barry. My Hit God. the fast forward again. We'll figure this out. Okay, we got this. We got this. We got it. We, we totally have got this. Probably not. Ross, how, oh ye of little faith, watch and observe how much I've got this. Okay. So she's walking off, but I have to walk up first, and oh, then she's there. Oh, and that's why Yeah, happens. and then she's over there. And then she's, and then I have to go up again. And there oh. she is. Yeah, that's really confusing and not intuitive at all. But that's fine. I'm not gonna so, oh, you didn't blame go up. the game. You didn't go up. Oh, I guess I'm that stupid. one doesn't. That one doesn't count. All right. Yeah. Whoa. Change the rules, Mr. Whoa. Game. Oh my God. <laughs> Stop. You can't just hold my hand. Yeah, and just casually. Okay. okay. Don't even wait for me. Don't and even we're back. Ooh, baby. Oh, and we're back. All right. Made it back to the pantry. Let's save this. Uh, as... Whatever, we'll just replace this one. Okay. Go for it, Ross. Oh, yay! It's your um, favorite thing. I don't know, like... <laughs> Ross! <laughs> okay, great, thank you. Um... Alright, now we're walking. Good job, honey. So we can't get thrown in the dungeon a second time. Why? Because she won't come and help us. Save. Really? The second time? You just get stu you stuck in the dungeon forever? Yes. That doesn't you, make any sense. You just get stuck and die just there. Just replace it with not Bajuga. Okay, now time to turn the speed down a little. Okay. Play. Alright, we had so many fast forwards that we're gonna play a little little overtime this this uh Sounds this round. good to me. Cause we got we got caught in some stuff. And there's the fucking cat, so let's respond. Wow, that was quick. Yes. Super happy to see him. God damn it. Is he gonna be there every time? <laughs> Let's see if he is. If not. Okay, oh, no. Okay, it is gonna... random. It is it, random. It is random, but it, man, it it's like Vegas random, you know? Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like definitely tilted against you. So we need to like Ah Okay, we can't get caught. Um, Punch him. Hi. Pie? We don't have any more pie. Moldy cheese. Peas. Peas? The diamond. The blue diamond. Throw the peas at him. Y Are you serious? Yeah! That was right? <laughs> <laughs> Boy, you definitely take out a lot of stuff just by, like, throwing food at it in this game. Graham wants no part of this beast. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it looks like the Cloverfield monster. I don't want to fight that shit. Yeah, the Cloverfield monster, like, 20 years before Cloverfield. Yeah. Okay, so we'll just casually strut. Actually, you know what? We should save it here. Yeah, that was pretty m remarkable. Um, uh, using raptor skills. Mm, go for it, Ross. Why do you have to fucking le You smell terrible. Please, please. <laughs> oh, thank you, Ross. Sorry. God, you should put on deodorant. I asked if someone had deodorant because I stayed the night tonight, and then no one had deodorant in the morning. Also, there's a cat. And God damn it. And you have to load the game again. Son of so a it doesn't even matter anymore, Dan. Oh, you're right. All right, next time on Steam Train, we're gonna we're gonna fucking we're gonna get past this cat. And I'm gonna take a bath. Ross, and Dan's gonna, gonna, gonna scrub my back. You, s I don't know about that last part. All right, I'll do it. Yeah. <laughs> we. Oh, welcome back to Steam it's a Train. It's cat. Okay. So it's time. I was gonna claw oh, you. It's time we Run. got rid of this cat. Run. So. Oh, why are you gonna do that? We're gonna fish. Get it's a person though. It's not really a cat. But he's got cat blood. Yeah. Boop. Meow. Oh my god, it looks like my See, cat. He's enjoying the. He's that enjoying the fish. Evil. So now we got him skinny. We gotta fuck him up. My cat's fat. He is fat. Orf is a fat ass. Mm. All right. So we're gonna use the bag of the empty <laughs> bag that the peas were in. I remember you were over. 
and like Orph was trying to eat out of his bowl of biscuits, so I like grabbed his back legs and like lift, yeah! lift, lifted them in the air, and he just walked around with his like butt in the sky, in the sky, and he just kept eating, and he's just like, well, this is life now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's it. Hold on, let me see what's up here. It would it be wise for Graham to carry the cat around? Now you know what you need. All right, I guess we're good. No, don't kill the cat. I like. Cats. No, we're not gonna kill the cat. Sick bastard. All right. But oh, look at it. It's in the fucking worm. It's breakdancing in there. He's, er, er, er. he's now out of our lives, so he can't tell the wizard uh, about us. Good. Yeah, it is good. That's why I did it. Oh, look at that skeleton. Ooh. It's kind of spooky. He's got really big hands. I liked. All right, let me see. You know what they say about big hands? What do they say, Ross? I don't know. I was asking <laughs> you. Do, do you know what they say about, no, about big hands? No, I sure don't. Oh. Look at how they did, like, look at how much they did with just, like, a few pixels changing colors, like, with the reflections oh, of the fire. It looks like there's reflections. Okay, Ross. <laughs> I don't need your fucking pity. Whoa, look at this bed. It looks like a Venus flytrap. Yeah, this is creepy. A large, grotesque bed occupies one corner of Mordak's bedroom. Oh, God, is that a weeping angel? I, I have, like, I have, like, a, a, like, I've developed a phobia of stone, stone angels. Let's find out. A strange statue of a winged woman stands yep. close to Mordak's mm -hmm. bed. She's just a winged woman. Don't blink. Not necessarily blink. an angel. Oh, mm. Do you know about the weeping angels? No, what's that? It's a, it's a, it's a thing from Doctor Who. Oh, okay. It's like they're, they're basically stone angels that can't move unless you're looking at them. Uh -huh. And every time you blink, they move towards you. And it's like super scary. Line the shelves oh. of Mordak's library. As Graham looks them over, however, he finds them mostly unintelligible. And, um, yeah, when they catch you, they send you back, like, 40 years into the past, so you have to, like, you, they, basi they basically make you live to death. Ugh. So you have to, like, live in a different time era. Lame. Yeah, it sucks. Douchey angels. A large tome lying open upon a corner desk attracts Graham's curiosity. I'ma read that tome, y'all. I'ma read it! Bullshit you read that. Hmm. No one reads that fast. This looks interesting. Oh. Graham wonders what the symbols mean. Tiger? Wait, were they sport teams? Yes. They did look like that sport That was how to logos. summon the Detroit Tigers to, uh, <laughs> to this game. Numerous books. <laughs> the strange symbols have been By the power of Detroit. <laughs> so, all right. So, now we've got the None spell. Of these particular books you got the spell? Yeah, yeah, we got- it just you said- should, You like, should the, probably put on your protection- protection. The spell has been burned into Graham's memory. Put on the, uh, the magic protection thing. Was this- does this still work? The amulet? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Check out this thing. Check out the oh, eye. It, did it blink? Yeah, it, like, follows you around the room. Oh, that's gross. Like, wait. Oh, no. I guess it's- I guess you have to look at it. I guess it's all sleepy now. Look at it? Uh, uh, nope. Just creepy background shit. Yep, creepy background shit. Great. I'm into it. Okay. Yeah. So this is an example of Sierra at its weirdness. Okay. At its weirdest, I should weirdest. say. Weirdest. Um, this is a part in the game. We need to wait for Mordak to come and lay down in his bed up here. Are you serious? Yep. And we're safe in the. St oh, there, there, he is. there he is. Oh my god, he looks like Count Chocula. Okay. All right. Can you go stab him with a stake now? I cannot. Okay. Let's save the game. Go for it, Ross. Okay. <laughs> you, like, spring to life every time it's time to, uh, save a game. Sleep more like... Da sleep... <laughs> sleep more like die! Good job, Ross. You're welcome. Alright. Let's sneak all up in there. Oh my god, he's in his slanket. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I just say about shishing? Slankets are very comfy. Mordak lies asleep on his huge, horrendous bed. Horrendous bed? It's a horrendous bed? Huh. Oh, wait, what's this thing? Mordak lies asleep. Nope. He probably Mordak got it from Ikea. Juan lies temptingly upon the small table oh near god. his bed. I can steal it. I'm gonna steal his wand, y'all. Swap, swap the wand. You could keep that one there and give him the one that doesn't work. Put the one that doesn't work there. I think I'm just gonna steal that shit. No, but if you put the one that doesn't work, he'll have a shitty wand and he won't be mad. Graham gives the wand a good shake, but it only fizzles. Graham gives the Graham gives the wand. No, I think 
Great. Oh, I thought it'd be I think funny. I'm just supposed to steal that shit and get out. I just thought if you like gave um, him the shitty wand, he wouldn't think that he didn't have his wand anymore. Right. And then you'd use the shitty wand. Uh, super sneaky. I guess if I if I wasn't such a nice guy, I could have just fucking stabbed him in the head right there. Oh well. But you might need him to release your family because you know you need a wizard for that shit. That's a solid point you just yeah. made there. I yeah. hadn't thought of that. Yeah. Great work. He's holding your family ransom. Oh for shit. Okay, this is definitely we definitely need to save right now. Why? Because this is as I recall, the the last uh board of the game. <laughs> no, yeah, I think Don't Die Guy is perfect. Oh. No, I get to write it. Alright. Does it really matter? Jeez! We're gonna write the same thing. Cool. Got it. Let's take a look around. Graham has found himself in a large room filled with many unusual contraptions <laughs> and magical implements. His heart feels like bursting when he notices his beloved family imprisoned within a large glass bottle sitting upon a corner table. Whoa! See, quite a lot of glass bottles is here, it, to be more specific. Is it this one? Or is it this one? Oh, it's that one. Tears come to Graham's eyes as he sees his beloved family and castle held captive inside a large glass bottle. God, it's like fucking Brainiac. Let's go, this bitch. let's go shake him around you a know little. Brainiac does that, or at least he did in one cannon. His waving family inside their glass prison causes Graham's heart to break as he realizes his current inability to save them from their terrible predicament. Okay, so let's see what we got around here. Hot coals burn in an open pit fireplace built at one end of the laboratory. Hot coals, baby. Nice. Get in that jacuzzi. Hot pot of coffee. Mm-hmm. Man, I don't think I can drink coffee. I don't think so either. Every time I drink coffee, I get explosive muck spray diarrhea. Which, uh, Ross, we're at the culmination of a very important quest here. Do you mind if we don't talk about your fucking bowel problems? Does coffee make you poop? Yes. Oh. Well, so it's it's like a butt relaxant. Ooh, whoa. What's this? Like a pot? <laughs> it sounds like someone's, like, whacking it. Ross, I need you to focus. <laughs> it does! Listen! Yeah, it totally does. I don't know what the hell to do with this thing. What, you just walked in on, like, Graham a big villain? No Shh! What and he's just whacking it. Contraption, but it couldn't be good. Inside the lower portion, a foul-smelling liquid bubbles, hmm. while two dangling spiked gizmos hang on a massive yoke above a couple of flat iron platters. Yeah, we can see everything you just said. Okay. Um... I don't know what the hell to do with this. Wait. Use the peas. Wait, clicking with the wand actually did something. Really? Oh, yeah. does this make magic? I don't know. Did it make a ding? Oh. Oh! I think you can put the his wand on the other side. Uh, and charge your wand. Oh, so you charge your wand, his wand, it, and then you give oh, his wand so back. Oh, so you transfer the energy. Oh. oh. And then and then you could probably give his wand back, and he wouldn't be any the wiser. Okay. Uh, is this good? Is this bad? Oh What's shit! What's going on here? Hey! I'll take care of you, you swine. Dude, suck a, suck a dick, man. Maybe you should- I bet he could do it. Maybe you should suck some dicks. Oh shit. Oh, he took his- that Oh, balls! Whoa, that was fucked Holy up! shit, that was brutal as hell. Damn. Don't, Don't die, guy, Ross. Stupid. stupid. All right, maybe maybe it's timed. Maybe there's a timer thing happening. Yeah, he might have woken up and noticed that his phone. I mean, his his wand was there. Phone. My phone is gone. <laughs> also, it hasn't been invented yet. <laughs> Who stole my iPhone? <laughs> I had the wand app on that. <laughs> Yeah, I wonder if, like, future wizards would just, like, fucking buy a faux iPhone and get the wand app. You're probably right. The wand app. This is <laughs> stupid. Maybe we did it the wrong way around. No, we- I- we didn't- we didn't activate it. We just put it on the plate. Like, it didn't actually, like, go through. Were you supposed to activate it? Yeah, of course! You gotta turn a machine on, man! 
you gotta turn on a grill to make pancakes. That's another example that's not exactly or at all related to this. Okay. I, uh... You figured it out? You know what to do? Uh, Damn, the world is watching. Uh, I hit don't a button, know what hit to a do. Hit a button, hit a button. Touch the thing. The bizarre machine looks very intimidating and confusing, the... which makes Graham reluctant to touch it. On switch. Conversely, though, <laughs> There's no it on also switch. intrigues him. Okay. Pull it down. We just gotta... We just gotta start putting shit onto this. Oh, the crystal. The crystal. Of course it's Graham the crystal. Hesitate. This may be the wrong thing to do. Oh, okay, maybe not uh, the crystal. The crystal would make more sense. Maybe uh, you bash it with a hammer. The magical Graham amulet? Hesitate. This may be the wrong thing to do. Nope. What about the, um, the moldy cheese? <laughs> the cheese? Graham hesitate. Nope. Let's try the cheese. Wait, Are you fucking it? serious? It was the cheese? Graham tosses the moldy cheese into the machine's bubbling liquid. What? What? <laughs> what? All right. Okay. Great. Of course it's the moldy cheese. Of course. We How did I not know that? <laughs> wow. Oh, man. Oh. Who knew that bacteria would power a machine? Okay. It's downloading. <laughs> Cop, don't copy. Don't copy that floppy one. <laughs> God, the dial. We made that dial. I bet half, of, like a big chunk of our audience, would even know what the dial-up noise is. Yeah, it's kind of scary to think about. Eh, let's not think about it then. No, let's not think about it. Okay, cool. Four deck wand now barely glows. Perhaps its power has weakened while Kristen's old wand now appears completely energized. Cool. Let's grab, grab that it. shit. Uh. Let's grab that batch. Let's yowza. Oh, wait, here we go. Oh, so now he, when he tries to do it, he won't have any energy juice. It's on, girl. What's going on here? He'll shoot blanks. I'll take care of you, you swine. Whatever, dickbag. Just let's do this. Ring it. Duck back. Graham, I heard from Kristen. Wait, what? Where? Where's? What? Hi, Cedric. Oh God, no! You Cedric! killed Cedric! No! What? Sorry, you're gonna speak. Oh, up. you fucking dick! What have you done to my wand? You think you can outwit me, little man? You son of a ah. bitch! Let me show you a thing or two. How could you fucking hurt Cedric? Whoa! Oh! Whoa. Shit, he's Whoa, a butterfly. He, he's a that's a dragon, Ross. Oh. Shoot shoot uh, shoot him with the thing. Um, oh shit, it was man tiger. Yeah, what do I want to do? Did you burn it into your mind or did you not really? Uh, no, it's burned. I just uh let's try the tiger. I think it was man tiger man. Tiger. Tiger man. Do you have to do it in order? What? No, I Tiger. Oh, I'm a tiger. I'm a tiger. We're fighting. Uh, yeah, I'm fighting as a tiger. Little... You son of a bitch. You ain't got shit on me. Turn into a. Take the form Woo! of a, a jet. Yeah, no, but dude, it's it's a. <laughs> Take the form of a dragon. Whoa! Oh, he did. Whoa, he took the form of a dragon. Oh shit! We turn. You gotta do that now. Okay. Uh. 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 uh, uh the, the top uh, left uh, one. This thing. The Okay, okay, that, that was, was probably a bad, that bad, was bad idea. idea. <laughs> yeah, definitely not the ferret. Let's not do the ferret next time. <laughs> Turns out ferrets are not effective against dragons. All right. I had no idea. We're gonna try that again. We're gonna try that again. Oh man. All right. Far back though. Yeah, Barry, we better fast forward. Yeah, Barry, do a little fast forward dingle. Okay, we are back. Hey. Are you ready for the final battle? Yeah! Excluding the final battle that just happened and we lost? That was the second final battle. Yeah, don't- we don't- I mean, the first final battle. We this don't the talk second about that battle. battle. Yeah, that's not, that battle wasn't important. Bring it! Turn into your stingy butterfly. I've Cedric, What, what no. do you say? And he's like, I'll save you. Oh, oh Cedric, I'm course. sorry, you had to die twice. Yeah, that poor guy. Mm. Die, Astonishing that his tiny owl sweater vest didn't protect him from the evil magic. He should be wearing fucking bulletproof vest so he doesn't get black black. Agreed. Get turned. All right, tiger. 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 Okay. 
Boom! We're fighting! Why, you little... Yeah! Who's little now? Bring it, bitch! What even are you? Like a crab... Crab... Chameleon dragon? That's some kind of stinging insect. That's a big ass tiger, though. Oh, yeah, that's a big tiger. That's some, like, life of pie shit right there. Ah, yeah. oh, that's, that's a dragon. That's, that's a larger dragon. dragon. That's a, that is... Uh, oh, let's uh, try this one. That's a man, though. I don't know what it is. It's a rabbit! Oh, but I'm too fast! Too fast! Too fast, too, too furious! Fast, too slow, don't you know? What's up, bitch? You can't get me, son! You're gonna run out of steam soon, son! Oh, I'm out of breath. I'm like, my tiny little rabbit lungs. What's next? What's next? I don't know. I don't know! Do something! You gotta do it. Oh, oh it's a cobra! It's cobra! Uh, cobra! Uh, uh, ah! Uh, uh, oh, uh, ferret, 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 ferret! What, just quickly do it! Turn into a ferret! Shh! Wine? It's okay. Now I have. I Turn didn't have ferret. the option. Okay, ferret, ferret, ferret. It's, it's not ferret. a ferret, dude. Uh, uh, mongoose, 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 mongoose. I don't fucking know, dude. I'm not a. Well, mongoose is important because mongoose is kill cobras. Snakes. Yes. That's right. Sorry, I got. Confused. Boom, baby. Oh yeah. 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 You ain't got shit. You ain't got shit. No. The way you want to play. Whoa. Okay. Turn. Okay. He's fire. He's a ring of fire. Oh, turn. What would fire? How do you fight fire? Turn it to oh, water. Perhaps with some rain. Bitch. Turn into a rain cloud. Let's do it! Ooh, ooh! Damn, son! Put that shit out, son! Your ass just got extinguished. Is that it? That's it. Is I think that's it. Oh my yeah. god! Yeah! Is that how he died? Yeah! Turned to fire and we put him out with yeah. a bit of rain. See, everything's fine except you know our family's still small and our owl friend is dead. If you just like. Whopped out his dick, flopped out his dick, and just peed in a circle. Ross, and that's how he died. Do me a favor. Warning. This part yeah, I think I'll skip the fucking majestic the ending where we get to watch the victory. No, let's watch it. I wish everyone would pee. Shh. Oh, cool. Now, why won't you work? Hey, girl. Bet she knows magic. <laughs> she just makes out with him in front of his tiny wife. Yeah. Oh, God. How about that? Oh. Princess Cosima. Well, I did it. Mordak is dead. <laughs> so Cedric. Says so Cedric. Yeah. Right Barry, zoom in on Cedric. <laughs> oh God, it's so sad. Look how fucking sad that shit is. Wait, we, we put R.I.P. Cedric we on the to, screen. Shush, we need to hear this. He'll never bother so anyone chatty today. ever again. R.I.P. Cedric. But now I have a bigger problem. I don't know what to do about my family or my castle. I don't know how to turn them back to normal. After all you've been through, there must be a way. Oh, hey. I have the solution to all your problems, Graham. It's Death Santa. <laughs> it's not Death Santa, it's the dude you helped at the beginning. I know, Death Santa. Okay. Remember me? I pushed out for this entire game. While you and Cedric were gone, I did some asking around, and I found out that your son, Alexander, had the dubious distinction, if you may, of turning Mordak's brother, Mananan, into a cat some time back. Obviously, this deed angered Mordak, who could do nothing about it, since this particular spell could only be undone by the actual perpetrator, oh. your son. Wrap it up, it Grandpa. It doesn't take a great genius to figure out that Mordak took your family and castle in revenge to try to persuade Alexander to restore Mananan back to his old self. I did discover, as now I see, that your castle and family were miniaturized and imprisoned inside a glass bottle. Ugh. I did some research. Ross, I'm sorry I told you to be quiet. This guy is saying nothing of value. Yeah, I know. I mean, the Jesus Christ told you they were in a glass bottle. It's like, do you? Do you no shit. Uh, slow on the uptake here, buddy. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Hocus. Hocus. Alliocus. Jesus Christ, does everyone just use password and admin yeah. here? <laughs> there's Alex, there's your son. Uh, and there's I, I don't want to alarm daughter. you, but... It's sh mm, there's your no girl! One, no one in your family has black hair. More blonde hair. <laughs> Aww. She looks like a queen, why don't you look like a king? Is Aww. he kissing his daughter? Yeah. Like making out with He's her? Just it's a little long. Planting one right on her lips. What's wrong with, with her, that? With his tongue. Princess Cosima, how could I forget you? Come over here. <laughs> Come over here. Come get a taste. I want to kiss you too. <laughs> <laughs> Let us all touch butts. <laughs> taste the graham cracker. <laughs> the graham cracker. Let me introduce you to my family. 
This is my wife. He's so Alex. jacked. <laughs> Look at my arms. Let my me do that again. Yeah. Prince Alexander, who started this whole mess. My my. All of you. <laughs> this is Princess Cosima from the land of the Green Isle. Oh, and here's where they start to fall in love. Would be standing here now. It's like a little pixel boner. Yeah. Slowly. Bink. No, like really slowly. <laughs> like you have to turn up the speed. I will make it up to you. With your permission, I'd like to travel to the land of the Green Isle to see you. She's like, whatever. Oh, no. All right. Now that we've done with all the formalities, let's get on with it. <laughs> all right. Now that you fell in love in 10 seconds. Piggledy. Piggledy. S seriously? S seriously? Cedric is still Like, dead. there's like three passwords you could guess for all this magic. <laughs> this castle is right back where it belongs. And the right size, too. But now it's time that everyone return to their homes with my help of course <laughs> and the help of my dead owl are they just leaving cedric what about oh yeah fuck him yeah. <laughs> oh right r.i.p cedric where is cedric <laughs> over there <laughs> over there <laughs> the pile of dead owl ah yes I think I know. Abra? Abra Cabara? No. God. Is it Abra Cadabra? Of course Abra it is. Abra Abra Fedora? Now, what is that confounded word? Oh, yes. Abra Cadabra. Yep. Goddamn right! <sighs> oh, why am I an apprentice to the shittiest wizard in the world? Cedric, it sure is good to see. You again. Oh, likewise. Oh, I'm a zombie now. Thanks for taking well, your I sweet time with resuscitating me. I'm dead. He's I'm a zombie. No, he's fine. He's I'm fine. I'm going to live my life in hell and deadness. That's the land of the Green Isle. Sorry, I've told you to shush like 12 times. I'm okay. <laughs> Goodbye, Alexander. Perhaps we'll meet again. You can be sure of that, milady. Oh, hell yeah. You'll be seeing more of this dick in the future. I hope the game ends with like Cedric going, "What a hoot that was!" Oh, and he winks, oh, oh, and then he says a shitty spell again. And for all your help, and you too, Cedric. <sighs> I wouldn't be standing here with my family without you two. I'm deeply, deeply grateful. All in a day's work, my boy. Whatever, boy. Dick. What? He did nothing. Right, Cedric. Right. <laughs> okay, back home you go. Why is Cedric Alex standing so far away? Alex yeah. Blue. Alex Just fly over there. Yay, goodbye! Oh, wait. Oops, that was my disintegrate spell. Yeah. <laughs> Cedric, let's get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Cedric, we can't let, We gotta hide out for a while. Yeah! Well, there she is. Our happy home. And we're all safe and sound once more. Let's go home, shall we? Yeah. Let's go home and put on a slanket. And watch Breaking Bad. Yeah! yeah! We did Wee! it, Ross! Here's a high five. Oh, dude! Top score! Coming for you! Yeah, man! Woo, man! 260, bitch! We played that very well. Thank you, William D. Skirvin. You the man. And all these other people are the man. Yeah. Except the women. They're the women. Wow, 14 people to do all the art for this entire it's thing. It's crazy. It's really impressive. It really is, actually. I'd love to know what the process was back then. Never mind. Uh, oh, actually, a lot more people. Yeah, make, well, still impressive. Make that 26 people. I mean, you gotta see the kind of people they use on the fucking AAA games nowadays. It's like, it's like, at least 30. Oh, yeah. Two. <laughs> hundred. <laughs> million. At least eight. Thousand more people. Mm. Mark Siebert. Siebert. Mm -hmm. Great job, Siebert. Good job, man. Robert. You're doing good. Dan, that your parents are proud. John, Randy Moss! There's two of you. Wide Eric. receiver for the New England Patriots? <laughs> he did a great job developing King's Quest V. Rob? Hey, Orpheus! Oh! Orpheus! Orpheus! Yeah. My cat! Wait, didn't that happen the last one? Uh, Graham! Oh, Josh Mandel. Josh Mandel was one of the writers for Space Quest. Oh, cool. And not a voice Wait, actor. Wait, who did Cedric? 
Uh, oh, we missed we it. Missed it. Damn. We'll, well, we'll be able to look back and watch, and then regret not. And then seeing regret not saying Ken it. Ken Allen's yeah. Yeah, fortune teller. Yeah. Man, these are people. These are people who did a lot of shit. The tailor was DJ Williams. Damn. The DJ Williams, who I've never heard of. Oh, the shoemaker and the shoemaker's wife were actually a husband and wife in real oh, life. Oh, that's Aww. sweet. Oh, 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 oh. Dick Roberts. Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> Man, Robert, Roberta Williams. Yeah, she's the creator of this game. Oh, man. Yeah, man. Is she related to Robin Williams? Yes. Oh. All right, Barry T. Smith was the eagle. Like, hey, I'm an eagle. <laughs> What's going on? Barry. Aw. This was a wonderful game. Oh, Dink was Barry T. Smith, too. He's good. I wonder why, if people are still watching right now. What? That us, us reading people's names oh, and just yeah. hanging out. I'm sure. Did you guys have fun? I hope you did. If you had fun... Don't say it. Just, 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 <laughs> I don't know, like, leave a comment. Yeah, maybe subscribe. But maybe. if you're, you're obviously already, uh, if you're not. Maybe you... like it. Maybe like oh, it. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. Guys, we love you. We'll catch you later. Goodbye. No, I guess there's more. Oh, it's looping. It's actually looping right yeah, now. Yeah, I know. Should we, like, end this yes. forever? Yes, yes. Well, we series. might as well wait and see uh, hmm? who Cedric was. Who Cedric was? Yeah. Okay, cool. How long we have enough to wait for that? I don't know. Yeah. Let's just hang out. Barry, just keep going. So what are you, what are you guys doing? I'm sitting on the couch with you, Dan. Yeah. No, I'm talking to our passengers. How you, are you having a, you having oh, a good day? Oh, you having a good day? You having a pleasant... Are you enjoying the time that we're spending together? Um, do you think um, maybe we can date? Who do you think is better looking? B or Ross? Are you on Team Danny or Team Ross? Team Ross. Leave your comment below. Yeah. I'm sorry I'm married, so you're probably all gonna have to go to Team Danny. Yeah, it's fine. They were gonna go there anyway. I so, think... um, you know, uh, or you could go on, um... Cedric was Richard Aronson. Show his IMDP page! IMDP page. <laughs> Show it right now. Look at all his roles. Scroll down. He's famous. Woo! We're done. Later. We're done here. Bye!